Hi guys, Josh here. I hope everybody's doing good. Sorry, it took me a few minutes to get ready, but I am here now. And today we are going to be playing Stardew Valley. We're going to be continuing our save file in the Meadowlands farm that was added in 1.6. And yeah, I've been wanting to play Stardew Valley for quite some time. It's it's been a while since I played it. Oh, Phelan re resubscribed on Twitch. Thank you so much. Oh, let me make sure the Twitch alerts are... Oh, yes, they are on. Okay, I just wanted to make sure they were on. Thank you so much. And happy to catch the stream. Hello, Josh in chat. Hope you're all doing well. Yes, I hope you're doing well as well. I'm so sorry. I have like a big red pimple on my cheek today i hope it's not too distracting whenever i look at my it's really distracting for me but i hope it's not too distracting for you guys happy two months sora thank you so much thank you thank you so yeah oh we got a hype train on twitch what a great way to start the stream so uh this stream is available on both twitch and youtube so as you can see there's some stuff happening over on twitch uh, hype train started so yeah if you guys want to support on twitch you can do that um i'm also on youtube so feel free to watch on your favorite platform whichever platform you prefer benzoyl peroxide for pimples usually I just it's gonna go away on its own um i got perfection on my last save last week Ooh, congrats shayna good morning good morning connor good morning gonna watch while working Nice. Hope you have a good day at work. By the way, before we start the stream, I may have to absent myself abruptly because um, not for a long time, but they're coming to do like a fire inspection in my building, in my apartment today, sometime between nine and five. But usually they come around 11. So I may have, I may have to like go away five minutes uh, whenever they knock on the door. So yeah, but other than that, we should be good. Yeah, so I hate inspections. I know there's always so many. I mean, they have to, but um, let me know how's the sound actually. Because yesterday, yeah, let me know if it's let me know if the music is too loud. Yeah, they always like, gotta do like the fire inspections, plumbing inspections, AC inspection, all of the inspections. Miggy Monkey shared 50 bits on Twitch. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. The main menu is the loudest. Yeah, okay, let me bring it down a little bit. And it's raining. So today I had kind of like a um, thing today. I wanted to actually start interacting with the villagers. Because I usually never interact with anyone in Sardu Valley. So I thought that today we might as well try to make some friends for the first time. Um, all right, so we got some peppers. Which I don't think I need for the community center, so I'm just gonna sell them. The audio is good, all right. Are you in summer and spring? I am in... Uh, summer. Day 13 of summer. Who are you talking to today? I don't know. I never talked to anyone, so I'm gonna talk to... Gonna try to talk to everybody, you know? Just make, make some friends. I played a little bit since last time as well. Since the last stream. A little bit on my own. On my game, I'm summer 24 of year 2 already. Oh my gosh, you're so fast. On the Meadowlands farm as well. You are so fast. The alerts are appearing on your face cam and not on the other screen, if that makes sense, I think. Oh, are they not appearing here? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah, the alerts should be here now. Oops. Make sure to keep one pepper for George's sneak quest if you haven't completed that. Oh, I've not. Okay, well, we're, we're going to get more peppers by the end of summer. So that's good to know. I did not know that. So 
I'll make sure to keep some for him. And yeah, let's go chat with people. Let's go make some friends. Uh, I don't know what. What's a good like universal gift? Ooh, hype train. Oh, oh. Miss Fang gifted a tier one sub to O Cray. Thank you so much. And one tier sub to Rune Factory Queen forty four. Thank you for the two gifted subs. We're approaching our goal on Twitch. We are getting close to our goal of seventy five subs. Thank you so much. Cross fingers for the crops to survive from the thunderstorm. Oh, does it damage the crops? Flowers are good gifts. Uh, yeah, I don't have any flowers. I do not have any flowers. Alright, let's go in here. That storm is spooky. It's Farmer Josh. Yes, it's me. Most people stay indoors on days like this. It's not good for business. I guess it's good to talk to people, though. It's good to... Makes it easy to find where people are. I just had trees damaged by thunder if no lightning rod near. Oh my gosh, in the game. Uh, I'm looking forward to fall, the cool mountain breeze, the swirling red petals, the smell of mushrooms. Ooh. What is this room? I'll turn of your bat. You can tell I never go inside people's houses in this game. This is such a big house. Is it just me or does Abigail look a little pale? You know what you look? I think they're pretty much the same, same skin tone. In game. Oh, okay. I'm glad. I'm glad it's not. Not in real life. That's good. That's good. That's good. I don't know if I ever went here. Oh yeah, I probably did. Hi Josh, uh read anything read anything interesting in the library lately? Not really. I know who I'm going to romance in this game too. In this save file. So maybe that's what we can... Maybe we can figure that out today. Everyone seems a little happier on the weekends, don't you think? Yes. Who have you romanced before? In my first save file, I romanced... Leah? 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 Yeah. Cause she reminded, she reminded me, she reminded me like of Anne from like Friends of Mineral Town and like Harvest Moon 64. Just because of the hair color, I guess. Cause oh my gosh, that's that's loud. Let me see if I've unlocked new bobbers. Oh, ahoy! Come in, make yourself at home. Oh, what's happening? Hey, that's good stuff there. The fish go crazy for it. Just uh, make sure to wash your hands after dipping them in those juices. The aroma has been known to linger for up to seven weeks, lad. Oh my gosh. So you've been catching a lot of fish? Ah, uh, yes. Aha, a man after my own heart. Uh, you can always trust a fisherman. That's what me old pappy used to say, at least. Uh -huh. Well, keep it going. If you can catch every fish in these waters, I've got a special prize waiting for you. Ooh. I have no idea what it is. Uh, oh, is everything okay? Uh, well, business has been tough lately. It all started about the same time that old community center fell to ruin. Me fish just don't sell like they used to. I've been working double time just to make ends meet. Oh no. Poor Pipa, nice to see you. I hope you're doing good. 
Uh, no time for my own projects, but if things picked back up around here, I might have the time to show you something. Uh huh. Yeah, uh, she's back there, an old friend that's seen better days. Oh, hype train completed on Twitch level two. Thank you so much. We got five sub gifts and fifty bits. Thank you, thank you. I'm thinking about romancing AI in my new file once the update comes to Switch. I wonder when it's come, gonna come to Switch, right? Hopefully it doesn't take too, too long. Nice hype train, yes. Oh yeah, I got so many bobbers. Let's take the little duck. So these don't make any difference, I think. They're just... I don't even know how you unlock them. Maybe just by catching more fish. I'm not too sure. There is a mod to replace one of the villagers with Astarion from BG3. I think I've seen that. I think I've seen screenshots of that. Lady Ray's been a while. Yeah, I hope you're doing good. Nice to see you. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Alright. So. Sebastian, is it Cave Carrot Tacos Night? Is it? Taco Saturday? Uh, okay, I met him. I talked with him already. Uh, who should we go for? Let's go see Haley. Let's go see how she's doing. I hope everyone is doing well. Yes, I'm doing good. Doing pretty good. Oops. I didn't even know you could sit. Did you guys know that? Did you wipe your boots off before coming? Sorry, I just cleaned the floor. Oh my gosh, I don't think I did. Yeah, you always keep your boots, you always keep your shoes indoors in these games. I feel like there's not enough games. It's such a small detail, but I feel like there's not enough games where your characters take their shoes off inside. You can sit most likely on the recent update though. Maybe like 1.5 or... Because I don't think it was in 1.6, right? It's cute though. I like that you can sit. Nobody really takes off their shoes indoors. I mean, in real life, most people do, right? But I feel like in games... It was in 1.5 where you can sit. Oh, I see. Yeah, I kind of missed 1.5. Um, Alright, well. Yeah, I need to find gifts. Let me get some forageables or maybe fish. Is there someone that likes fish? Asian culture, that's true. We always take our shoes off. I think it's more... I feel like... It seems definitely more important in Asian culture, but I feel like mostly everywhere... I don't know. I feel like beside, like, except for, like, some, like... Maybe some places in the U.S. that don't do it. I'm not too sure. But honestly, everywhere I've been, I've always taken my shoes off. Like, in Canada, I've always done it. Everywhere I've been in the U.S., I've always done it. In Europe, as far as I know, everybody does it. I don't know. I don't know people who keep their shoes indoors. I feel like it's only in America you keep shoes inside. At least in Norway, you always remove shoes when entering homes. Even electricians and other trades coming to work. Exactly. That's just... I mean, you walk on so many things outside, right? Even just like walking the streets kind of dirty. You don't, you don't want to bring that in your house. Good morning, Kuab. You're not too late. We just started. I hope you're doing good. Are you going to the Georgia route, Georgia route or community center? I think I'm going to do the community center. Because I never like completely finished the community center. I was missing one item in my other save file. So, yeah, I'm going to do the community center.
Uh, also... I don't know what I was gonna say. <laughs> I, I started a sentence, but I have no idea what I was gonna say. I still question myself, I want to play test Stardew and Need Further since I test multiple games. Yeah, I don't know, it seems like you're always playing a lot of things. It is fun though, it is definitely worth playing. Hi Josh, hi Ron, homie B, I hope you're doing good. 468 hours on Stardew. Oh my gosh, you have a lot, a lot more than me already. We do it in Canada because we're used to removing them with the snow in winter, mud in fall, and slush in spring. Yeah, that's true. The southern countries don't have this problem, so it's not a habit, I guess. Yeah, but even without the snow, I mean... I don't know, when you still, like, walk in the streets, there's, like, dust and, you know... All the things... Everyone thinks Americans keep their shoes on. I have no idea where they get that from. The one I know keeps their shoes inside. Where do people from other countries get that idea from? Yeah, I think it's... I think they get that from, like, TV shows and, like, movies. Because, like, if you watch, like, American movies, they're going to go on their bed with their shoes on and, like, walk around their house with their shoes on. And also video games. I mean, even in Japanese video games, actually, they do keep their... Sometimes they remove them, but most of the time... Most of them, they keep them as well. So, yeah, probably from movies. I watch a ton of UK shows and they have their shoes on as well. Yeah, actually, it's, this, it's the same for... I guess there were more American shows than, like, British shows. So maybe... I don't know. Nothing like dragging jug dropping inside after having stepped in it, right? Even if you don't step in it directly. Like, there has been some where you... Like, there's gotta be, like, remains of stuff. Like, even if you don't see it, you know? Ooh, we... Oh, stone. Okay. I live in Ohio, and most people will keep their shoes in their own house. Ooh, interesting. This is the first person we're seeing, saying that they keep their shoes in inside. When I visited the UK, some household definitely wore shoes inside. Maybe it's an English thing that they brought to America. I don't know. I guess TV shows and cartoons in general, as a kid, that's always what I see. Except in anime, they always remove them. They even have tons of scattered slippers around their homes. Yeah. So I guess I guess it must come from TV shows. And their whole house are carpet floors. Oh my gosh. Carpet is so annoying. But yeah, definitely, like, I wouldn't walk. It's one thing to walk with your shoes on, like stone or like wooden floor but on carpet I think keeping shoes was more of an old generation American thing oh maybe it is an old something they used to do and they're stopped doing it I don't know All right, it's 9 p.m. Let's go to bed. Let's go to bed. I'm going to keep the flower for a gift. And yeah, because today, let's check, our, let's check our relationships. Yeah, I have one heart with Robin. Everybody else had zero hearts. I want to try to... I want to try to get a few hearts today. We have a large mudroom and then a tiled kitchen and the shoes come off before the carpeted living room. Yeah, in the country a mudroom is kind of a must. 
Yeah, that's true. In my school, we weren't even allowed to keep shoes on in the classrooms. Oh my gosh. I think, you know what? When I was a kid, in elementary school... Oh. Trees drop 25. Chance for double harvest. Let's go... Ah, which one should I pick? What do you guys think? When I was in elementary school, not in the high school though, but in elementary school, we did have to change shoes for our class. We had like indoor shoes and then outdoor shoes. And we had to change. But in high school, we were just wearing like whatever we wanted. Morning, Josh. I'm about to head out for a day of doing Uber Eats. Oh, I hope it do goes well. Planning to play some True of Tranquility tonight. Oh my gosh, that sounds so much fun. I've been aged since I played the Wii games. That sounds like such a fun day. I hope your your Uber goes well. And I hope... Yeah, True of Tranquility. I want to play that. I want to play that. In New England, in elementary school, we had mud rooms between every two classrooms or we would change our boots and ski pants. That's good. Yeah, because I guess New England is kind of like Canada, right? You got lots of snow and like everything. For some reason in high school, we didn't have this. So we had to change in the hall or bathrooms. That's weird. The one on 10. Oh, the one on 10 skill you get. Let's forage. Uh, forageables be iridium quality. Oh, so I should speak, uh, take the gatherer, right? Okay, let's go with gatherer. Oh no, I'm late. Hello, friends. Lisa, nice to see you. You're not too late. We just started like 20 minutes ago. We are just getting started. Uh, dear Josh, I saw an article ooh, about you in the local paper. It sounds like the country life is a good fit for you. I'm so proud of you. Take care, sweetie. Thank you. I wonder what kind of article. Uh, hey, kid. My throat has dry as a desert bone. I'm thirsty for pale ale. Oh, yeah. So I need to buy... I need to grow some hop, right? I don't know if I'm growing... Let's go buy some... Let's go buy some, some of those seeds. Christy, nice to see you. I hope you're doing good. Selfie Masters, nice to see you. The farm's looking real nice already. Not too bad, right? It's a start. Oh, did I forget to feed you guys yesterday? For some reason, when you read that letter, I thought a newspaper actually covered you as a content creator. Oh my gosh, that would be so fun. Not yet, though. Not yet. Sorry for the... <laughs> Sorry for the disappointment, but maybe, maybe sometime in the future. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean... To, oh my gosh, I cut my... Oops. Uh, let me make some mayonnaise. I was playing a Wonderful Life remake before the stream. And they're in the end of chapter 4 with my... Um, in my file with Gordy. Oh, nice. I really have to go back and finish... Finish that game. Does a new farm come with the fence and paths, or Josh has decorated a bit already? So the new uh, the new farm comes with uh, the chicken coop and this fence around the chicken coop, but it doesn't come with the paths. So I did the paths and I did the fences with the like this little farming area. Yeah. So I did most of it. It it just comes with the chicken coop basically. And all right, so let's go buy some hop. Seeds. It's raining a lot, right? I can't wait for the update to come to the Switch. Yeah, hopefully it's not going to be too long. I've, n I've never... You know what? I've never played Stardew Valley on the Switch, but I know a lot of people... I know a lot of people are waiting... Uh, I want to try giving my cows flounder to increase their milk production. Oh, yeah. I know cows would eat fish. Uh, oh, it opens at 9. 
Sunnyside announced their release date May 24th for Steam and July 10th for... Con yeah, I've seen that. It's a lot sooner than I expected. I'm kind of a little bit worried. I'm a little bit worried of like how much they're going to be able to, to do. Um... Maybe six. Uh, corn. Yeah, I'm not gonna have time for that. Can I buy? Mm -mm -mm -mm. Maybe some melon. And yeah, let's buy a new bag upgrade. Yay! I think I wanted to key. Oh, I wanted to buy some cows. I wanted to buy a barn and a cow. Well, we'll do that. I'd love to have that by the end of the stream. Have a nice barn. That game is in 3D for 1.0 1, 1 for at least six months. Right? That's what I thought. I feel like that's... I feel like May is very soon. Maybe, maybe their publisher wanted it to be out. I don't know. I played it a lot on Switch when I wanted to take a break from modded Stardew Valley. It's pretty fun and made me love fishing more than when I played on PC. Oh, I never, yeah, I never tried with the controller. I wonder how the fishing feels. Stardew was the first game I got on Switch because while there were games out, I wanted I want to spend an extra $60 when I got the console. Yeah, that makes sense. I didn't realize it was out. It came out on the Switch like around the release of the switch um yeah this one i gotta be careful because it's you can't walk through that one you know what i love thunderstorms in real life I don't think I love it in this game. It's kind of intense. Uh, summers. Do I need any? Yeah, I think I can just sell. You know what? I kind of want to keep it just in case. And yeah, let's go. Give some gifts to people. Go try to make some friends. The only part I enjoy about the PC version was the fishing mod. I can't do fishing on Stardew. Yeah. I never tried any mods yet. I want to play the whole game without it. And then maybe after that I can try, try some few mods. Can you make... Lightning rods yet? Oh, that's a good point. I don't think so. Yeah, no, not yet. Yeah, it would be good to make before summer, right? B like, while there's so much uh, storm, so many storms. The thunderstorms are supposed to carry in this game. Every time I get it, I jump. <laughs> Every single time it rumbles, right? It's so, it's like so loud. It's so loud. And like, I don't know. I love, like, I feel like thunderstorms are so, like, cozy in real life, you know, kind of peaceful, but... Christine, you cheered 100 bits on Twitch. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Emily usually cooks dinner, but she makes weird stuff like quinoa. Ooh. You guys like quinoa? I think it's not too bad. It's not too bad, but for me, like, in terms of grains... I think rice is, like, white rice is hard to beat. I know it's not the healthiest, but... It's hard to replace. Uh, I really should take the time to test the growth rate and profit of crops in summer. Parsnips are best in spring. Potatoes a close second. Ooh. Yeah, I don't know too much about, like, in this game, which crops are really, like, the most efficient, most profitable. Oh! Uh, pretend you just want a free vacation. Where would you go? Oh, the beach and the dark cave, the old gnarled forest, Joja Mega, Joja Mega Mall. Uh, let's go to the beach. I think that would get old fast. Really? Uh, 
Uh, I hate thunderstorms in games. I can't do the flashing. Thankfully, most games have an option to turn off the flashes or disable thunderstorms. Yeah, is there an option in this game? Because it flashes a little bit, right? Oh, it's the music. The music was so low. Oh. Did you know you could change the fishing sound? Oh yeah, you can disable them. Um. Yeah. All right, let's go back to our farm. Pam is thirsty. Oh yeah, she wants a Marnie wants a flounder, right? Yeah, let's do that. Where do you find flounder? Is that in the ocean? Let's do some fishing. Let's try to find that for her. Do some requests. After all, we want to make friends today, so... I should do some some requests. You can change your bobber too at Willy's. Yeah, I changed it. I have the little duck now. I changed it just a little bit earlier. For the longest time, I avoided Stardew Valley because of how the characters looked like. Yeah, I didn't avoid Stardew Valley, but... I'm definitely not a fan of how the characters look like. I know I could download a mod to like change them, but... Maybe that's why I also don't talk to anyone. I finally tried the game when my friend recommended me portrait modes. Yeah, there's so many, right? So many good portrait modes. Maybe I should... I know I want to kind of wait before downloading mods, but... Maybe a portrait mod would be nice. Oh, flounder. That was quick. Lucky. Uh, so let's give it to Marnie. If she's home. She's always out. She's always like... Whenever I want to go see her, I'm, I'm struggling. Sorry, Skies Gaming. Hi, Josh. How are you today? I'm doing pretty good. I hope you're doing great as well. I hope you're doing good too. Sparkly, sparkling Sakura, I hope you're doing good as well. Yeah, Marnie never works. I know. Oh, there she is. Never mind, Marnie. Uh, yeah, it's good to see you too. Hello, Josh. You brought me the item I asked for. Thanks so much. Here's a little something for trouble. Thank you. Dun, dun. Uh, Mayor shorts. I forgot where I got them. Cauliflowers. He's gonna wait for a while. Pale ale. I'm working on it. Mines. Let's go see Alex. We didn't see Alex today. Cauliflower takes a while. It does, and I think... Um, what should I do on such a warm, lazy day? I don't know. Just take a walk under... Take a walk under the thunderstorm. Oh, the shorts are in Marnie's bedroom. Oh, so I was there. Let's go grab them. Let's go grab them. Yeah, then we're gonna go see Alex. Oh yeah, here are the short. Oh, you need to be friends with Marnie. As a Harvest Moon fan, do you prefer their games over Stardew? I'm always curious as to how it holds up compared to the older Harvest Moon games. Like, Stardew Valley is very fun because there's, there's really a lot of content. But I don't know if it's, like, nostalgia. But... For them, it kind of depends. It really depends on, like, what kind of mood I'm in. Um... Yeah, if if I want like decorate my farm and like 
played for like hundreds and hundreds of hours, like a long time. Like Stardew Valley has definitely a lot more content and things to do. But I find that a lot of the older Harvest Moon games, I don't know, I like their simplicity sometimes. You know? And I found the characters more interesting. Like I find that the cutscenes and the characters were more fun in older Harvest Moon games. Yeah, it's hard. It's really hard to compare. Like, it just kind of depends. Depends on my mood. Should we go mining for a little bit? I had portrait mods the entire time I was playing. On my perfection run, it threw me off when I got back to Switch. Right? I can imagine. Yeah, it's a shame there's no... Mods are not really possible on the Switch. Stardew also have slight randomness, so no run is fully the same. That's nice. It's nice to have little differences, you know? I never had portrait mods uh, other than running super fast and gifting once a day. Oh my gosh, a, a, a mod to gift once a day sounds so overwhelming. I kind of like... I really like actually that in Stardew Valley you can only give twice a week. It makes it less overwhelming. Whereas in games where you can gift once a day... Like, I don't know, that's a lot. That's too much work. Even twice, like, like, twice a week, I don't even do it. Maybe it's just me, but I don't know. I don't think it's just you. I think there's probably other people. I mean, if there's a mod for it. If there's a mod for daily gifting, probably a lot of people ask for it. Hi Josh, is this your first Stardew Valley playthrough? I've been thinking of starting one and find it intimidating. Oh, you should don't be afraid. Honestly, there's no like there's no rush, there's no there's a lot to do. But there's no rush, there's no wrong way to play, there's no like time limit, so do it. It's not my first playthrough though. I played it. My first like kind of like longer playthrough was when the game released in 2016. Um, so this is, and I played a little bit like in between, but this is really my second playthrough actually. I did another one, but it was I didn't play like for that long. So yeah, this is my second like proper playthrough, if you wanna call it that. And the game changed so much since, but yeah, don't feel overwhelmed. You can do it. Never had mods except that farm mod to make my house, barn, and coop green. Ooh. Yeah, I feel like if, if I would download mods, it would definitely be, like, just visuals. Like, either to make some textures look better or, like, to change some of the characters, like the portraits. My gosh, these little zombies are annoying. But in terms of gameplay, I don't think I would really... Maybe one day I can try, like, Stardew Valley Expanded or, like, something like that. But no, not for now. I think the to-do mod is really helpful. Oh, what is that? What is that for? Have you tried any mods yet? I've been wanting to try some. Yeah, no, I've never, I've not tried any mods. Okay, I should bring my, I should bring some torch next time because I'm realizing it's really dark. And I can't see. I really can't see. Oh, I think I leveled up my mining. Uh, 
All right, 34. Oh my gosh, it's 1 a.m. almost. Okay, let's go home. At least we got to a new, like, unlocked a new thing with the elevator. Even my small Asian eyes have a hard time squinting my eyes to see anything in that section of the mines. Yeah, I mean, I don't think the size of your eyes <laughs> makes a difference in, like, seeing, but... Yeah, it is really dark. It is really dark. So next time we'll bring a torch. Will it try Stardew Automation Mod? Probably not. I love automation in games, but unless the game was, like, designed for it. Probably not. Okay, let's go to bed. Yeah, level four mining. Transmute. And glowstone ring. Oh, does that make you glow? I guess. Right. A green rain has descended upon the valley. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Are we gonna die? What's that? Saw the weather report last night. I'm not sure what will happen, but if anyone wants to take shelter in the saloon, I'll keep it open all day. What's happening? Uh, okay, let's go to the saloon, I guess. Is that new from the 1.6? Is that something new? Even inside the chicken coop, it's green. That must be so traumatizing for the chickens. Get your scythe out. Why? Cut grasses and special trees. Okay. Apparently I should cut grass. I want to go to the saloon too. I want to see. With the blue grass? No. Oh, the weeds. Oh, moss. Oh, you can get moss. I see. Oh, yeah, and that tree is different. Oh, yeah, I just noticed. Yeah, they give you moss. And I wonder what kind of wood. Maybe regular. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, that's a nice addition. The real Sim Shady, nice to see you. You should also talk to the villagers. Yes, we should. We're gonna get some moss. Then we're gonna go after all our goal today is to make some friends. So we will go talk to the villagers. There's so much new stuff. I'm starting to feel like Stardew is getting a bit bloated. It is a lot. I don't know if bloated... Not as bloated as, like, Sunhaven feels bloated, but it is a lot. Sometimes you don't need... Sometimes less is more, right? But I feel like most addition, most stuff that they add does, like, make sense. You know, some games, they just add stuff for the sake of adding stuff. Oh, you get more from the huge weeds. Oh, yeah, I saw some. Oh, these ones, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, nice. I'm not too sure with the moss. I think you can make... Can you make, like, the mushroom? I forgot what you make with it. Oh, yeah, mushroom lugs. Uh, okay, let's go see the tavern, the saloon. I played the older version of Stardew and that was fine already. Yeah, honestly, I think Stardew Valley never... Oh. Oh my gosh, there's so much stuff. I don't think Stardew Valley ever lacked content. Like, even the first time that I played, before, like, any of the updates, it was, like, there was already quite a lot.
If you see a fully green tree, cut it out. Cut it down. Six thousand hours. Oh my gosh, Maya, that is so much. I don't know if I've ever played a game. Maybe. Well, Minecraft doesn't count your hours. But if there's one game I would have played six thousand hours, maybe that would be Minecraft. Or The Sims 2. I actually played The Sims 2 yesterday for our member streams. That was so much fun. Uh, okay, let's go check the saloon. Oh, yeah, everybody's here. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. I didn't mean to give you that. I saw the weather report last night. It really gave me a scare, right? What? What is it? What's that green rain? Let's not get in a tizzy now, Gu uh, Gus. I propose a round of drinks to settle the nerves. I don't think I've ever set foot in this place. It's actually kind of cozy. There must be a meaning behind this. Nature is trying to tell us something. It's situations like this where a person's true character is put to the test. I hope these weird rains don't bother the fish. Yeah, I hope not. It's a sign from the Almighty. We're doomed. Oh, no. Are you all right? We're all wondering what's going on. What is going on? I brought some medical supplies. Okay, let me give some gifts to people. Alex is not here. We've been wanting to see him, but he's not here. Little gift for her. Little gift for her. Does Weedy like clam? Oh no, he's allergic to this. I'm so sorry. I am so sorry. Some you can speak to twice. Oh. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm sure the rain will pass, right? Oh, why can't I speak with Elliot? Oh, because I already spoke with him twice. Probably. I just got off the phone with the governor. Apparently, this rain is supposed to be completely harmless. Just an unusual phenomenon of nature. Still, some of the townsfolk are panicking, which is never good. Yeah. Hopefully, tomorrow. Tomorrow is going to be back to normal. I always create a world on Minecraft. Play for a few hours and then never return. For me, it's been a while since I played it a lot. But I used to play on the server. So, like, I would play with... People pretty much every day. All right, let's do that. I don't know what you can get from this. Can you get anything by being good at this mini game? I love the music. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh no. Okay, I thought it, I thought it was something bad. I guess it's good. This is fun. Steam achievements. One for never dying and one for finishing. Ooh, I see. Maybe we can try to get, get some achievements. I don't think I'll do it without dying, but if I can finish it. Oh. Well, so far, I'm doing not too bad. I don't know how long it lasts, though. I don't know how long the game is. Oh, there's another area. Whew. Okay, let's do this. I love the music. Oh, we got new enemies. 
Ooh. Not too bad. So far, so good, right? That mini game feels impossible. TBH, it's so hard. So far, it's not too, too bad, but I can see it becoming pretty hard later. I love it, though. It's fun. Oh, no. I didn't see it. I didn't see it. Ah. First death. I'm pretty good at Junimo Kart, but Prairie King pisses me off bad. Oh, what's Junimo Kart? I don't think I've ever done that. Is that the other machine that I can't, like, you need to unlock something to play it? I don't know what's that thing. Oh. Don't stand next to those. Oh, okay. Sorry, there's a... I think they're starting the fire. And sp sorry for the weird noise. Uh, which one should I get? Is that a permanent? Can you guys hear that? Oh, you don't hear it? Okay. If you guys don't hear it, it's fine. Not enough go. Oh, yeah. I do. Oh, my gosh. I was trying to read the chat. Okay. I'm getting distracted by that sound. Yeah, I just have one life left. Sarafina, nice to see you. I hope you're doing good. Welcome. Oops. Yeah, I was doing really good at first, but then I got the... Oh, I have one more life. I have one more. I can't really focus now. Oh, it stopped. The sound stopped. Oh. Uh, yeah. Okay, quit. All right. So this one, yeah, this one I can play, right? Yeah, this, you need a key. Well. Not too bad, not too bad. Did we get some hearts? Oh, we got one heart with Haley. Alex, why is he not at the saloon? Why is Alex not at the saloon? Let's see if he's home. Oh, yeah, they're all in the kitchen. Oh, my gosh, look at the TV. There's so many little details, right? It's so fun. The rain is glitching the TV. Uh, what's going on out there? Any action? Uh, George dear, is this the end? Oh no, it's been a good life. <laughs> but I'd like to see Alex find his way before departing. Oh my gosh, there. There, there, honey, don't you worry. Even if it is poisonous, I breathed in more noxious gas in one minute back in the old coal mines, and I'm still kicking. Alright, so. Let's go. Should we go mining a little bit? Let's go sell some stuff, because my inventory is getting pretty full. This is like that time when you got Super Ultra Mo focused on that snake minigame into Pixel. Yeah, that's so fun. Honestly, I love games with minigames. Like, also the one in Palea, you know, the little... Um, 
the whole game where you run and like shoot, they'll you have to jump and shoot. Right, let's make some coal and yeah, I can sell a little bit more stuff. Sell this. Yeah, the Chapa shooter. Yeah, that one was fun. I need to go back to Pele. I keep saying that, but I really do. Let's go open these geodes. Oh, it's gonna close. It, I think it closed at 4 p.m. Okay, let's just go mining then. You gotta chop the vine looking trees for fern and moss uh, and tree seeds to grow those trees when it is in train. Oh, you can grow them by yourself. Okay, let's try to get those seeds. Did I get some? I got moss. Okay, if you tell me I can get the seeds of those trees. Oh yeah, this one even transformed. Yeah, they all. Yeah, okay, let let me get those. Mossy seeds. Okay, let's try to get those. I didn't know we could get seeds. Oh, see, I got one here. So are the other trees going to go back to their normal form? Or are they going to just stay mossy? They are a bit rare. Yeah, I got one, but... I tried to get some more. There's a big green vine in town. Chop that for fern. Ooh. Okay, let me try to get... I didn't see it. Okay, let's go back to town. Uh, let me just make some... Seeds. Some field snacks, I mean. Uh, acorn. Maple seeds. Pine cone. And okay, that's not a lot, but we go to the forest. There are lots there. All right, let's go. Let's cr try to do as much as possible uh, for today. Oops. It will do for now on stamina. Yeah, I, I, well, I don't have that much. Oh, this one, right? I think that is the fern. Oh, yeah. Fellow head friend, what do you do with those? Young shoots are... Oh, 25 energy, 11 health. You can probably... Use them for something else too. I'm gonna keep them. Uh, do you know if and who you will marry? I don't know yet. That's why today I kind of wanted to socialize a little bit. Oh, see, we got Linus here. All these strange trees will be gone tomorrow. It's one of the mysteries of nature. Oh, I see. See, he knows. He knows more than everybody else. Everybody's worried and he's just... He's completely fine. He knows what's happening. Aside those weeds, they give you fern. Yeah, I've been doing that. It's beeping. I know it's gonna stop soon. They're doing some uh, fire alarm like testing stuff. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry if you can hear it. Some people can hear it. Some people cannot. But I hope. I hope it stops soon. Make a poll, but then again, that will depend on which personality we click with you the most. Yeah. Anyway, I'm not there yet. I mean... 
I, I don't even have like one heart with anyone, so I still have a long way to go, but maybe later on we can make a poll. You can go to the spot to get your energy back. Oh. Oh, here, right? And I don't even know when I unlocked this. I don't I don't remember how you unlocked that area. I don't remember when that happened. Actually, to be fair. It's my first time coming here on this save file, but I, I just like completely have no idea. On the 3rd of spring? Oh, is it that early? That's so early. I do hope you befriend Sean. No need to marry him, but he really needs a friend. Yeah, I want to befriend everybody. I think there's a big vine in the town. Yeah, we're going to go. I'm going to restore my stamina. Then maybe we can go to... Oh, it's already 10 p.m. Time flies. Oh, third of summer. Okay, yeah, that makes more sense. That makes... Mo so sorry for those alarms. So sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry if you hear those. Sorry, they they distract me. Uh, all right. So, oh, who's that? Not mind me, Josh. I'm just collecting some samples. This might be a once in a lifetime opportunity. Oh, it's Demetrius. I thought it was some weird kind of like alien or something. Oh, Sha oh yeah, Shane. Yeah, sorry, that was a. Uh, no typo, yeah. Oh yeah, there's a fern here. I don't hear the beeping, maybe because I'm on speakers. Yeah, you're not missing out too much. And there's another one here, and then, and then we gotta go to bed. Race to the house. Yeah, I have time. I have time. I think I got most of the fern. I'm sure there's probably more. Yeah. But it's good. Yeah, I like that. I like that day. We've got lots of fern, lots of moss. Oh, you need one of those for the bundles. Oh, do you? Oh, so did they change? Did they change some of the bundles? Because that was added in 1.6, right? So how is it part of the bundles? Oh, no more rain. And the beeping stopped. Everything stopped at once. Oh, no. No, still rain. <laughs> still rain. The rain never... Oh, the beeping is back too for me. Honestly, I can't wait for those thunderstorms to stop. Oh my gosh. That rain will never allow us to hear the music, right? It's been raining since the beginning. Uh, I need, okay, let me go to the community center. There's a bunch. I have a bunch of stuff to, to give.
I think they're coming. I'll, I'm going to be right back. I think they're coming in to test inside. I'll be right back. Sorry. All right, I am back. I'm so sorry. Um, there was, they came inside to do the the testing, the fire inspection thing is, and now it should stop. Hopefully the beeping is all gonna be stopped now. So, yeah, back to. <laughs> I think I can actually like concentrate a little bit more on the game. Yeah. So people have been saying the fern was already in the game before. Oh, I see. I thought someone else said it was new. So maybe, I don't know. Anyway, anyway, let's. Uh, oh, I've got hops. I can make the beer for Pam. So we're gonna do that. And they had to come in my, <laughs> every time, like, every time they come for the inspection, like they come in my room and I'm always like kind of shy because <laughs> I've got like all of these like farming game stuff and I'm always wondering like what people think when they come in my, in my gaming room. Oh, the fern tree is new. The fern itself is old. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Hardware. Oh, I can finish that, actually. I, I got some hardware. I can finish that. Summer crops. We've got the tomato. Uh, missing melon and blueberries. Spring crops. I'm so mad I missed some spring crops. And, oops, I think the other one is here, right, for the fern. That's done, and then, yeah, I think that's all. There's copper bar, but I can do that later. All right, let me get the hardwood. I can finish the construction bundle. Oh, you can put your jam in for artisan. Oh yeah, true. You're so right. You are so right. Wait, where is it? Chef, die, field research, enchanter. No, that's not. Where's the artisan one? 
Who knows? Those inspectors might be fan of farming games as well, right? They didn't look. <laughs> they didn't look like farming games people, but maybe you know. Sometimes you never know. But they didn't say anything. Um. Oh, artisan bundle. Oh yeah. That is done. And also, I got the fruit cave. Let me check if I have some fruits. Usually, I used to always take the mushroom. Wait, did I take the mushroom caves or the fruit caves? Maybe I took the mushroom. Because now you have the mushroom logs, right? So. I forgot which cave I took. Let's go check it out. I'm done with work. I can finally focus on the stream even more. Migi. Good job. Congrats. Just converting inspectors into full-time farm sim fans. Who knows? We gotta get more people into farming games. This. All right. And let's check the cave. Let's see if there's stuff in there. Oh yeah, oh, I took the mushrooms. I should have taken the fruits, actually. It's fine. We can make some dehydrated mushrooms. I'm just gonna keep keep them. Those mushrooms lugs with the dehydrator is broken. You can make so much money from that. Oh, is it? Um, hardwood. Oh, I don't have enough hardwood for the thing. I need to start reorganizing my chest, by the way. I was kind of organized at first, and then... Oh, let's open those geodes. So this is decorating and, like, random stuff. This is the mining stuff. And this is the green... <laughs> Green chest for all the, the the all the plants and the forageables and the stuff. But yeah, I'll have to start. And this is random. Oh, I do have enough hardwood. Okay, so let's bring that. And then let's go to uh, open the geodes. When someone was here to repair something, they saw my FF7 Sephiroth stuff and started small talk about it. It was kind of nice. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. That's a good thing with like Final Fantasy is like well known. I feel like people don't know too much about like farming games. But that's nice. Sloothy TV, nice to see you. I hope you're doing well. Uh, construction bundle. Let's see what we get. Bundle complete. Oh, charcoal. Turn 10 pieces of wood into one. Okay, that's nice. I didn't have one yet. Winter foraging. Fall foraging. Okay. All right. All right. All right. That's nice. Because I didn't have too much charcoal. Oh, I need to make sure I keep my melons. Animal bundle. Dude, I want to buy a barn, right? Can I? Do I have any? Uh, let, let me go see the blacksmith, and then maybe we can check if we can. We should work on our barn. I'm super sick from my long and stupid lupus flare-up. So thanks for streaming today. You made my day. Oh my gosh, I hope you're doing. Yeah, that sounds like a lot. I hope you feel better. Well, I hope you're having a good time with the stream and can chill a little bit. It's raining so bad all the time. I really hope tomorrow. I really hope tomorrow we get a sunny day. All right, blacksmith. It is definitely helping. That's good to hear. I'm glad to hear it. Ooh. Saves you watering. That's true. Honestly, I don't mind the rain. It's the thunder, the 
thunder. I always like, I don't know, it's so loud. <laughs> and yeah, there's no music, right? All right, we got a few good, a few goodies. Speaking of goodies, Concerned Ape says there's going to be another little patch or like update to 1.6 with a few goodies, like some new, new stuff. So I'm looking forward to seeing what's, what's going to be in there in the next little update. All right. So we got one, two, three, four. Five, six new things here. Nice, 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 nice. Ooh, a night on Echo Hill. Does the green rain affect your crops? I've yet to check out this update, so I don't know. I don't think it affects your crops. It just it pops up like trees that you can get like moss from, and like these big ferns where you can get moss. Uh, fern from but i don't think it affects your crops in any way don't try to fish in a thunderstorm every time thunder rolls you will hit the button to catch the fish without there being a fish right you just like have the reflex to click uh let's go check you know i want to see how much the barn costs Yeah, I don't know if there's... Is there, like, a specific fish that's just there during thunderstorms, though? That I should try to catch today? Or is it just the same as the rainy fish? Okay, nice to see you. I hope you're doing good. Hope to... I hope you're doing well. Uh, Okay, farm buildings. I need... Just the money, I think. I think the wood and stones, I'm fine. And I sold a bunch of stuff, so I think I'm gonna get... I'm gonna have my money pretty soon. Oh, it's the same as the rainy fish. Okay, so it doesn't make any difference in terms of fishing. That's good to know. So... Yep, 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 yep. Gonna sell that and yeah, we gotta make some friends too. Uh, maybe we can go see. I can sell that, right? And that. Can I sell that? I'm like never sure of like these minerals and stuff if I should sell them or not. Let's go make some friends. Let's go see Haley and Alex. I feel like I like these two. Oops. Don't sell the earth crystals. You need them for... Yeah, I know. That's the only one I know. Like the crystals, I keep them. Oh, I already gave her two gifts. I spent all morning doing my hair and all the rain couldn't mess it up. That is so true. Stay inside. Stay inside, Haley. Don't. It's not worth messing up your hair. There's nothing, nothing exciting happening outside anyway. Let's go see Alex. Oh, there he is. I saw you checking out the bathhouse the other day, trying to get in shape. Yeah. Uh, I'm looking for someone to bring me 15 iron ores to aid. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's do that. Oh, by the way, did I sell? I think I always... I think I do the same mistake every time. I grow the hops for the pale ale for Pam. And I tell myself, oh, I need to, like, make the beer. And I completely forget. Oh. 
When people come to my place, they always seem weirded out by how many books I have and the fridge. <laughs> weirded out by the fridge. Yeah. Books are good, though. Like, that shouldn't... They are the weird ones if they're weirded out by books. Okay, I kept my hops. Okay, that's good. Uh, I forgot how... Oh, is it in there? Or... I forgot how you make the beer. Is it in the barrels or is it in the preserved jar? Oh, you need a keg. Oh my gosh. Yeah, okay. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Okay, so... The keg is, um, it probably comes with the farming skills, right? Just need to increase my farming skills. Level seven farming or eight. Oh, I see. You know what? Oh, I had, I thought I didn't have the <laughs> charcoal stuff. I, I did have it already. Actually, by the way, I keep forgetting to watch the TV for, um, oops. I keep forgetting to watch the TV for the recipes. All right. Um, all right. Let's go back out. We still have a lot of energy. Bagel Bite, nice to see you. I hope you're doing good. They rerun on Wednesdays. Yeah, but I missed a lot of them, I feel like. But yeah, tomorrow is Wednesday, so tomorrow we're going to watch. Watch some TV. And you know what? Since it's been raining... I should have upgraded. I'm, I think I'm going to do it now. Let, let's check the weather. I really should have done it. Like, it's been raining so many days in a row. Oh, it's sunny. I should have I should have upgraded my watering can, right? It was the perfect, perfect time. Oh, I don't even have silver, actually. Should we do that? Go get some silver today? I don't have too much time. Well, let's do it. Let's go mining. Let's go mining for a little bit. That's how you get recipes. I haven't watched any of them. I'm in the middle of winter. Yes, exactly. I feel like I've never done like that much cooking in Stardew Valley, but yeah, it's good to like try to accumulate those recipes. Sundays are new recipes and Wednesdays are rerun if you missed it for the week. Yeah, I missed a lot of days though. I missed like reruns and I missed I missed both Sundays and Wednesdays for like a few weeks, so. Oh, you can buy a book and get them all. Oh, that makes things so easy. I didn't know that. I know you could get them from a book. That must be like an expensive book, right? Oh, also, I had a quest. Yeah, 15 iron ores for Clint. Oh, I forgot the torches. I was talking about that yesterday, and I, I still forgot. Next time. I think it's 25k or something crazy like... Oh, I see. I mean, it's not too bad, like... Depending where you are in the game. Like, at the beginning, it's definitely a lot, though. Yeah, honestly, without the... Without the torch, it's not... By the way, how can I make the glowstone? 
Oh, solar essence, yeah. I, I won't be able to make that anytime soon. You know what? Let's just go to bed. I need some light. Not like that return scepter that costs two million. Oh my gosh. What is that? What's a return scepter? It's nice when there's some expensive stuff in games though. Because like, like a lot of farming games, you get money. Like you make your money and then you have nothing to spend your money on. So it is nice when there are lots of like very expensive, expensive items. Oh, it warps you back to the farm. Oh, that is nice. Yeah, we don't have enough money quite yet for the barn. <laughs> Yay, finally a sunny day. Finally some music. Yes, that is so good. Uh, I think... I'm gonna need more melon because I need to get the um, gold, gold star melon. It's so nice to have some, like a sunny day. Let me know if you cannot hear the music. I'll put it louder. Uh, maple syrup, I think I can donate it for the community center. I'm going to do that right away. Otherwise, I'm going to forget. Is there anything else? Oh, I think that's sun sunflowers. And the uh, one regular melon, too. Gold crops are ridiculously RNG to get for the bundles. Honestly, they're not too hard to get. You just need to plant. Like, I, I that's my fault because I didn't plant a lot. I didn't plant a lot of melons. Let me see if I have time to grow some more. I have seven full bookcases. People don't usually have quite that much. Yeah, that's a lot. That's nice, though. I don't have a lot of books. I feel like recently I've been, like, doing, like, audiobooks more. I like books. The thing with books... Like, for example, like, collecting books... Collecting video games, for example... I like it because... Um, like, you can replay those games. But I feel like when if I collect books, like every time I bought a physical book, I never read it a second time, right? So if you collect books, you read, like, do you keep them because you like to read them again? Or do you keep them because you want to just like look at them and like remember when you read them? That's the thing. I like the idea of like having lots of books. But yeah. I reread most of my books. I've had to replace some because they've fallen apart from being read so many times. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, I don't... Because I don't... I, f I guess I don't read a lot. So if I were to reread something... Like... Oh, Oak Resin. I think I have that. I don't read a lot in the first place. So when I read, I try to like read something new, you know? Yeah, um, all right, so we got some stuff done here. Let me see if I can go buy some more melon seeds. I wish I have the space for books, but I can't even imagine having to pack all of it when I move. Yeah, that's the thing too, right? Oh, close on Wednesdays. Today's Sam's birthday. Oh, we missed, we missed Alex's birthday, I think. Uh, today is Sam's birthday. I don't even know where he lives. <laughs> I'm so bad. 
We should go see him. That's our goal today to make friends. Like I've been here for like a year. Oh yeah, there. I have a book nook in my house for my favorite books. I usually do library books, but I go and buy and collect my faves. Oh, that's nice. I had 28 boxes when I moved here and 22 of them were books. Yeah, that's a lot of boxes. I feel uh, if you don't move too often though, it's not too... What is he doing? Yeah, I can't. I wanted to give him a birthday gift, but he's not. I'm going to give it to Vincent. And uh, all right, so let's go back to the farm. He's sleeping with eyes open, right? He's in his bed, but he was not like sleeping or anything. And he was not even like in the middle of the bed, like when people are sleeping. That little girl cried just now. I don't think she liked the melon I gave her. Okay, I gotta keep the gold one. I'm gonna keep my hop. Oh yeah, I need to watch the TV, right? For the queen of sauce. Pancakes, oh my gosh, that is amazing. I love some pancakes. Yeah, oak resin, I can give that. I'm gonna have to make another chest. Maybe a chest where I can just keep. Uh... Okay, let's make a chest. I'm gonna make a chest where I just like keep some of my crops for cooking or like trans processing or community center like you know and oh yeah i'm gonna bring some torches go to the community center then we can go mining a little bit i don't really get the point of cooking in this game unless it's for a community bundle because right now i'm just using mayonnaise for energy and health it works perfectly i also get baked goods from bins yeah honestly even like in my first safe i don't remember cooking too much is mayonnaise good though because i remember last time i drank it i got like one hp or like one stamina does it give you more I feel like it doesn't barely gives you anything. But yeah, there's definitely ways to like. Yeah, I feel like cooking is not the most useful. I usually just have a few field snack or I just go to bed. I like games that incentivize you to actually cook. Like one good example is like Harvestella. Where like if you want to run, you have to eat like at least like once a day or something, right? Um there's a few other games like that where like they really incentivize you to like cook and I like, eat eat like a proper meal every day. Grapefruit, nice to see you. Hope you're doing good. All right, let's go mining. Yeah, immortal life too. Cooking is really important in that game. Uh, do you have sword? Yeah, this little sword. Oh, Sam is out now. Seems like there's no damage or anything. That was a strange one. Yeah, I'm doing good though. Let me give you some hop. Hey, 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 you remember now that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, do I have a heart with him now? No, but he's going up. He's, he's up there now. What 
What did you say? It's 12.20 p.m. already? My goodness. All right, let's go mining. Let's go mining. I'm glad we got one heart with Haley, one heart with Alex, one heart with uh, Robin. Robin or Leia? Robin, yeah. Chewing stick. Ooh. I made it in time. About to finish work finally. Well enough to watch again. Boopy. I hope you're doing good. Congrats on finishing work. Oh, the mayo gives you 55 energy. Maybe I did something. I feel like the last time I drank it. Maybe. I don't know. I feel like when the update came out, I drank mayonnaise to see and it gives you like one energy. Maybe it depends on the quality. Because I remember I said like, oh, there's no use. I said something like there's no point in drinking it. Maybe you were full? Yeah, I don't know. I remember it because I clipped it on Twitch. Oh! I not even noticed that. Yeah. Oops. Yeah, those little zombies are so annoying. I'll have to try it again let you guys know. I swear it's 55. Maybe we can try because I have a lot. I mean, I'm making it every day. Oh my gosh, I think I forgot to take care of my chickens today. Oh, oh my gosh, I got a houseplant. I didn't know those zombies could give you house decor. It still sounds gross to drink mayonnaise. Definitely gross. But it gives you some energy. Could be worth it. True, I have a quest. I need to get our I need to get 15 iron ore. I hate to say it, but in, in real life I'm the type of person to eat a full spoon of mayo and enjoy it. Oh no. I mean as long as you enjoy it. For me, I like mayonnaise. Like I like it like in stuff. Like in cooking, but like I wouldn't eat it on its own. <laughs> But if you enjoy it, that's that's what matters. Oh my gosh, I'm so lucky with all of these ladders. And floor 40. Yay. We got a slingshot. And now I gotta reach the bottom of the mine. I'm getting the better weapon. That little sword is not doing not not amazing. I will do that with cheese. We'll gladly eat a spoonful of it. Yeah, I mean, cheese makes sense as a snack on its own. I do have cheese as a snack. Like, but just mayonnaise? I don't know. <laughs> Weird confession time. I love the smell of mayo. I hate the taste, but I've been known to sneak a sniff out of the jar from time to time. Oh my gosh. Doesn't it taste the smell? Doesn't it taste the same as it smells though? Oh, is it because of the texture that you don't like the taste? That's interesting. Well, that's good because you can it makes you like enjoy the mayonnaise without the calories and everything. So, I guess that's I guess that's good. My favorite is the QP mayo, but I will never drink it. Yeah, the QP mayonnaise. That's the mayonnaise I use most of the time. 
It is. I'm not too sure why it's different, but it is better. But yeah, still, I, even though it's better, I would not like drink it. Oh, you can reset level 40 for iron ore. What do you mean? If I go back to level 40? Or like 41? Oh, yeah. Here. Oh, my gosh. You're so smart. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, uh, can I just like do it over and over again? I used to mix ketchup and cheese as a snack because I'm a weird kid. Ketchup and cheese? That's a mix. I've never heard of. Can't be too bad, though. Uh, why was the music so sad? When I was like three, I thought mayo was cool whip. And ate a big gob on my finger. almost barfed. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. I still can't send Mayo 30 years later. Oh, my gosh. That traumatized you. Yeah, I can't imagine mixing up, <laughs> like, whipped cream and mayonnaise. Ah, those monsters are annoying. I'm just trying to get that iron... Oh, I need two more. I need two more. A good snack. A slice of bread with mustard and ketchup with a slice of cheese on top. And then microwave for one to two minutes until melted cheese. Ooh. I used to... Yeah, honestly, I used to have a microwave oven. I don't have a microwave oven. I don't have a microwave anymore. And I don't have, like... I guess you could do that with an oven. But yeah, just like cheese with like bread, um, bread with cheese in like a toaster oven or like microwave oven. Uh, yeah, I meant to say toaster oven. So it like grills, it doesn't just melt, right? Do I actually like make it grill? I'm hungry now, me too. I just had a carrot muffin for breakfast. My little brother used to microwave a bologna slice so it turned into a little bowl and then fill it with ketchup. That is so cute. <laughs> it's so weird, like, as kids, like, we made up so many... So many... Weird snacks. Alright, so now I've got enough iron for that quest. I don't have enough for myself. Oh, you can keep the ores after Clint inspect them. Oh, never mind. We will get to keep them, so that's nice. So tomorrow we're going to go see Clint. Unfortunately, it's 11.47 uh, p.m. for us. We should not eat, right? I'm sorry for those who are... At the end of their day, where we can't really eat too much more. He's in the saloon now. Oh, is he? Let's go see him. I never go at the saloon. I guess that's a good place to... Good place to make lots of friends. In one place, you know? Yay! Oh, I got a prize ticket! So, by the way... Do I... Did I get another one earlier? Probably. Chips and sandwiches is delicious. 
As in crisps or fries, both? Ooh, I've never done that. Like potato chips or like french fries. Yeah, I've never done that. I made my British manager grab a snack because I was showing him some of our cuisine. Now he's like, I'm going to grab a sandwich. Now I'm also hungry. Honestly, I'm getting hungry too. We're all getting hungry now. All right. House plant. Oh, it can only be placed. Only in the house. Um, I have lots of plants already. All right, let's put that here. Let's sleep. All right, we got, oh, we got a new, oh yeah. So let's go see, uh, oh yeah, I want to buy melon seeds. Oh my gosh, I forgot to water my crops. Yesterday was sunny, I did not water my crops, right? I really did not. I don't know why. I guess it's been raining for so long and I just... I forgot to take my chickens out, I think. Oh my gosh, I forgot so many things yesterday. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I forgot to do I so many things I forgot. We gotta get back on track. And then after that. I'm gonna go buy some melon seeds. Oh, fries and a burrito. Ooh, that sounds good. I think one of my little things wilted here. Oh, I've got some news idea, new ideas to sleep on. I want to check my farming. Uh, what level? Seven. So maybe I'm going to get the keg. Maybe I will have the keg. Um, I think Maya said earlier it's either like level seven or level eight. So we'll see. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, okay, let's go buy some melon seeds. Do you have a favorite Mexican food for Thai dish? I know you like Pad Thai. Ooh. It's kind of like a simple answer, but maybe tacos. Like, tacos are hard to beat. Like, tacos are really good. So maybe that would be my favorite, favorite Mexican food. And they're so, like, versatile, right? There's so many... Like, if you feel like seafood, you can have seafood tacos. If you feel like beef or, like, chicken, like... No matter what you feel like, you know, you can have... There's a taco for you, you know? Uh, melon seeds. Tw oh my gosh, 12 days. 18. Is that gonna grow? No, because there's only 28 days. That's why... Ah. I don't like games with 28 days. Mm. Yeah, we won't be able to finish the gold star bundle thingies. Yeah. What a shame. What a shame. Oh, the puppy goes in a bundle. Oh, speed grow. Oh my gosh, can you use something to make them grow faster? Oh. Pine tar. 
by at least 10%. Is that going to be enough? Like 10% because I have... It takes 12 days to grow and I have 10 days left. Can you come accumulate them? Can you use it like every day or is it just once? I'm more of a nacho guy, but they are a bit messy. I almost... It's been so long since I had nachos. Should be enough just before sewing. Okay. Okay, I believe you guys. I trust you. I hope it works. Pine tar and moss. Okay. Okay, let's go to the community center. And then... Okay, let, and then we gotta get working on that. We talked about this before, but I like nachos, but I don't like the uh, yellow cheese. The American kind of weird yellow cheese. But if they're nachos with, like, actual cheese, then I'll enjoy them. Um... Where's the poppy? Does not sell them to maybe, but I want if I can make them by myself. That's probably gonna be cheaper. Where does that poppy go? Rian, nice to see you. F Dragon Love, nice to see you. It's in the Bolton Bar, oh is it? Oh, because it's a different color. Okay, that's why. Okay. Thank you. I would have never seen it. All right, so now. Yeah, let's go make. So I need moss and pine tar. So. I'm not too sure about the pine thingy, how much I have. For the melons to be done in 10 days, you need deluxe speed grow at least. Oh, do I? Hmm. I don't think. Because otherwise, yeah, because 10% is not going to be enough. Yeah, it's just, it's not deluxe. I can still make it, but let me see if he sells the deluxe one. Cause yeah, I'm pretty sure like 10%. Oh, but it says at least 10%. Maybe it like rounds it up. Maybe you were gifted some. No, I know I don't have any in my chest. How was your trip sing family? Oh, thank you for asking. It was pretty fun. It was pretty fun. It was raining when I got there, but it was snowing when I got there, but then the weather got nice and yeah, we had a good good time. Um Yeah, because this big grower is like so expensive. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna work, honestly. Uh oh let me check my dehyd radar, by the way. Oh, I can... You know what? Let's grow some corn. Because that's in summer and fall, so it's not going to wilt. Were you able to play games with your fam? Yeah, we played some board games. And I played a game with my brother. I played Cuphead with my brother on the Switch. That game is so hard. I tried playing it. I tried... I played it a little bit by myself. But I didn't make too much progress, but we played together and we made 
we made a little bit of progress, but that game is so hard. It was really fun though. It's such a beautiful, it's such a nice looking game too. That was really fun. Wiki says 11 days with normal speed grow. Oh, yeah. So it's not going to work. Thank you so much for checking. Yeah, I'm going to keep keep my speed grow for like some something. But yeah. Uh, I want to go. Uh, oh, yeah. I want to make. that and we're gonna go back do some mining oh frozen geode there's gonna there's gotta be some good stuff in there uh jade all right Oh, let me try to drink the mayonnaise. So we've been having a little... Oh, 90 energy. Oh my gosh, it is good. It is really good for energy. Maybe they maybe they fixed... Maybe there's been like a patch or something. I swear when I, when I drank it for the first time, maybe it's an acquired taste. Maybe the first mayonnaise you drink gives you one each, one energy. Oh, a train is passing. Oh, that makes sense. You can, like, grab some items, right? Uh, I swear the first time I drank my eyes, it gave me one energy. I'm not... I Like, I remember, like, so vividly. But now it is really good. Thank you for the Pikmin postcard. Yeah, I'm glad you got your little postcard. I got lots of... Lots of new Pikmins. If you guys are playing Pikmin Bloom, there's like cute little Easter egg Pikmins right now that you can get. You need farming level 8 to be able to craft the Lux Speed Grow. Oh no, I just got to level 7, so... Yeah. I won't be able to finish a community center in one year, that's for sure, but... Yeah, at least... At least next year. I don't want to go swimming if that's what you're going to ask. I was not asking that at all. What farm type is that? It's the Meadowlands farm that I'm playing on. That's a new farm that was added in 1.6. You don't need to do anything with the train, right? You just wait, I think. It's been so long. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Got some coal. Got some iron. Oh, some more coal. Nice, nice, nice. Maybe some fodder, some wheat. Oh, no. And that's all. Not too bad. We got some We got some good stuff. Some iron. So, all right, now let's go mining. I just make sure there's nothing on that side. Yeah, nothing. Yeah, that was a good train. Can you get other things? Or is it just mostly just ores and coal? I live next to train tracks. I wish I got to pick up stuff every day. <laughs> every time one goes by, right? That would be so nice. A lot of what these trains are carrying are car 
chassis heading to the Ford plant, so I don't think I want those, right? Maybe if they're the full... Fully ready to use cars, that could be more fun. All right, let's get some silver. Is waiting the train worth it though? Especially when you got lots to do in the farm though, like later in the game. I think it is. I mean, there's no like, for me, the way I see it when I play this game, there's no like, there's no rush, right? I'm not trying to like min max everything, like, every, and like optimize every single minute that I play. So I don't mind waiting for the train. I guess you could just go at the end of the day. I don't know if the train still drops stuff if you don't like... If you don't grab it, you know? If you don't... If you're not there, will the stuff be there like later in the day? I'm not too sure. But for me, it was worth it though. I got to talk with Sebastian, so... Oh, you have to be there. I see. Yeah, it was worth it for me, so. Oh my gosh, these little guys are so annoying. Break the crates, thus you could get a new weapon. Yes. Oh, let's drink some mayonnaise first. That's gross, but... It's so good though for your energy. Like you, yeah, you really don't need to cook anymore. I feel like is that's too good. Like that mayonnaise is too good to be true. That's like way too good. Cheese is great for energy, too. Yeah, I've not made any cheese yet. I need to start working. I really need to get a barn. Especially before winter, I want to have a bunch of animals. Out of all the food items, it's funny how mayo of all things is the OP food item, right? It's so easy to get. I wonder if it makes things too easy sometimes. Let's try to get to 45. Is it? Yeah, the next is at 45, right? Or does it go to 50? There should be an elevator every five floor, right? Every time I saw a new world after playing for five minutes, I realized the legendary fishes are waiting for me, which makes me exhausted even before trying. Oh, no. I don't think I got... And I don't know. I don't remember the legendary fish. Are they really, really hard, really rare to get, really hard to get? Oh my gosh, it's midnight already. Okay, let's try to get... We're just so close to 45. Let's just try to get there quickly. Oh, I don't know if I'm going to have... Oh, you're so annoying. I don't know if I'm going to have enough energy, though. Oh, yes. We did it. They're so hard to get. Like, one for each season. Oh, I see. Oh, we got fireflies. Okay, let's go home. 
I wonder which one is the first. I was gonna go down by the town and like go e go west, but then I figured, yeah, I don't know what's the fastest way to go to the mines. Is it easier if you go up your farm or if you go to the town first? Such a good feeling getting that last needed ladder, right? Just in time too. Just in time. Oh, let's make some more. Iron. Oh my gosh, I forgot to take care of my... I forgot to pet my dog. Nice, so now we got the hardwood fence. Cheese press, quality sprinkler. Oh, level... I thought I was getting level 7. No, I'm level 6. Uh, cheese press, so yeah, I'm gonna need... I'm gonna need cows. Oh yes, blueberries, I can finish one bundle. Okay, let's do that right now. Usually you don't get a coop and chickens until a little later, so early mayo is definitely a perk of the Meadowlands farm. That's true, yeah, usually... It never takes too long to get, but yeah, it would take a little bit longer usually, that's true. The dog sleeps with you on the bed now, that is so cute. It is cute. I don't know if that's a new detail or if it was always like that, I'm not sure. Alright, so that is done, but they'll complete. Oh, nice. We got a quality sprinkler. Also, I unlocked the recipe for sprinklers. I don't, like, usually make lots of sprinklers. Yeah, you need quartz and you need gold and everything. So maybe later. Maybe later, but for now, I'm fine with my watering can. And I'm going to upgrade it soon to... I just ordered myself a walking treadmill and rewarding myself um, by ordering three books. Ooh, walking treadmills are so nice. I have one. I got one in January and I've been using it kind of regularly. Um, honestly, it's, it, it is it is really nice, especially if you're at the computer a lot, you know, and like might as well, might as well walk at, while you're doing something else, right? Walk and playing while playing some games or something. It is really nice. I think I, sh I should be able with those blueberries maybe to um, do to build a barn tomorrow. Oh, Sebastian likes quartz. Maybe I can keep some for him. I'm gonna put the sprinklers here for now because there's stuff there. Yeah, after that, we're gonna go give some gifts to the people. Uh, Josh, it's a bit out of context, but you should try Brown Dust 2 if you haven't. It's an RPG game free to play. Ooh, I've never heard of it. I don't know if I, I have so many games I need to play, but I'll keep it in the back of my mind and if a lot of people recommend it. I might check it out. I don't play a lot of free to play. Like, I play a few free to play. Like, it's it's hard to keep up with all of these games. I'm hop I'm hoping it will be convenient to hop on during by 15 minute breaks at work, and it will be quiet enough to walk while watching YouTube on my days off. I hope so. Mine is pretty quiet, but I have like headphones right so like but yeah honestly my walking treadmill i use is not too loud the only thing is i have to like it depends on your setup but i have to like take it out and like put it under my desk i can't just like leave it under my desk you know so it's always like a little bit of work to like take it out and it adds up, you know, those little frictions of like getting everything ready every time. 
So for me, like, usually when I use it, I'm gonna use it for like an hour or two. I don't take it out for like really, really short periods. But yeah, hopefully, hopefully you like it. It's a smaller one. I don't have much space, but I think I have room for this little one near my bookcase. And then I can rest my hands on my bookcase for balance too. Yeah, that's good though. Mine is also, I think mine is like a little bit larger than, not like the smallest ones. Because I was scared that like too small was going to be like, uncom like too narrow to walk on. So I got like slightly bigger, but. Still. Uh, all right, so let's open the geodes and go to the museum and do all of that stuff. I won't be able to run on it, but I'm not much of a runner anyway. Yeah, usually even like those smaller ones anyway, they don't go very fast. They don't really let you run even if you like really wanted to. Um. Should I upgrade? No, I need to. I need to. I wanted to upgrade a tool, but I need to focus on my barn. All right, let's open the geodes. And yeah, let's open the geodes. And let's go give some gifts to people. Let me bring some nice, uh, let's see if I have like some berries or like flowers or something. Mm. Yeah, I don't have too much. I don't have really. A f yeah, maybe summer squash. I'm counting on guys to keep shaming me into using it on Discord. Yeah, we'll we'll remind you. Honestly, that's one thing. Sometimes, like, I feel bad. Sometimes I'm not using it, and I feel bad for not using it. Because I want to be, like... I feel like I could always, like, be more productive if I was walking and, like, using it at the same time. So sometimes... Sometimes it's a little bit annoying because of that. Let's go see Alex and Evelyn. George spends the whole day in front of that darn television set. He's not. He's not. He's outside. What I like about Stardew Valley is that you can water the milk crop. Harvest Moon fans back in the day will relate. Yeah. I mean, most farming games nowadays, you can water the middle one. But it is it is a nice quality of life to be able to walk walk in your crops. Alright, let's see what we get. I saw somebody on Instagram using a walking pad and sometimes a mini stepper with separate joy cons to play. Ooh, while she walks. Yeah, it's hard to depending on what you do. Sometimes I do play games while I'm walking. But like... Yeah, depends on the speed too. Like, if I'm doing something like that requires a lot of concentration, I can't walk too, too fast. But like, if I'm just like watching videos, then I usually like walk faster oh my gosh so many so many rewards let's see what we've got drum block plays a drum sound oh singing stone jade hills oh my gosh we got so much i'm, I'm gonna need a bigger house i'm gonna need to expand my house because i don't have space for all of these things when I bought the ring fit, I felt so bad for not using it but the game got too repetitive i stopped playing it and go and quit uh guilt dripping myself yeah honestly if the game is not that fun don't 
Don't feel bad, right? One game that I feel like is really good for fitness is like DDR. They don't make any new DDR games, unfortunately. But these games are always so fun. And like such a good way to like get some exercise. Oh, go turn in your ticket. Oh yeah, let's do that. Let's see if we get anything good. I want them to release new DDR games. I need to get, I still have a Wii actually. I could, well, a Wii U. I could get it. I need to get the Wii DDR games. Ooh, Summer Squash. Am I gonna have time to grow them? Oh, there's gonna be some mystery, mystery boxes. Um, six days. Oh yeah. Yeah, we can grow them. I got to level 440. It's not worth... Oh, in ring fit. It's not worth it. It gets to a point where they have you do nothing but squats to get to the stage. For 30 minutes, no personal trainer would recommend that. Yeah, that sounds like a lot. That sounds like too much. It's hard to make a game that like... Like find a good balance between like fun and like tedious exercises, right? It is really repetitive after... The main story and not worth it. What's DDR? DDR is Dance Dance Revolution. So it's a game with like, you had like a dance pad and like four arrows and you need to like, it's a rhythm game, right? And you had to step on the arrows at the right time. It was so fun. They used to have like a lot of PlayStation 2 games, arcade, obviously like lots of arcades, but if you wanted to play at home, uh, PS2, and we there were like two we two or three we games got my little drum yeah i don't have space for that painting it's a really nice painting but we'll have to we'll have to expand our house first Oh, I should have put them around the spring. Oh, well, I can put one here. Yeah. All right. Then let's water that. I hate the super r slow running speed and ending able to get once a day on this. I feel like the running speed is not that slow, is it? I feel like it's not too bad. And then once you have a horse. Um, all right. Chickens are good. We still have a lot of stamina. It's a little bit late to go mining. So let's just... Um... Let's... Oh, yeah. Let's see if our mushrooms are ready. Nice, nice, nice. And... Oh, a package of gourmet... Mur what is that package? For? Oh, is all that, oh, these are the dried ones. Okay. 325. That's... Oh, let me see. Can I make more dried ones? I think I can. I need five. Ah, uh, four. Four. Yeah, not quite. Not quite that. I'm going to keep them. I can make some mushroom lugs too, actually. Let me make some. Because I have moss. And hardwood. Let me see if I have some more wood somewhere. Okay, I can make one. All 
I'm gonna put it in... Can I put it inside the cave with the other ones? Oh, yes, you can. Oh, that's nice. Is there beekeeping in Stardew? I played for 80 hours, but I forget. There is beekeeping, actually. There is. One little pet peeve I have with this game is that if you press anywhere, like you can go to the other tabs, but if you press on the map tab. Oh, wait. Never mind. Oh, you have to click. I know, it's kind of weird. Well, you can't see the other tabs anymore but yeah if you click outside of the map actually okay never mind never mind okay so okay all right so let's make yeah beehives you need iron bar maple syrup and wood i could make one actually i could make a few one let's do that i forgot about those put it near mossy trees it works better by trees oh does it that's Good to know. So, okay, we got wood. We've got the iron bars. I can make some more, actually. Um, by the way, I need um, 350 wood for... Okay, I've got 299. Oh, maple syrup. I don't have maple syrup yet. But I need to get more wood because um, I need 350 for the barn. Yeah, I need to make more little taps for the maple syrup. Steven, nice to see you. Hope you're doing good. Yeah, let me make mm, the tap things copper bars Let's make two of those. And then place them on maple trees. Um, I'm gonna have to like... Organize, make it look nice, but... Wait. It's so hard to see. Is this one maple tree? I don't know if they're these ones or if they're the ones with the yellow. I guess we're going to see. We're going to find out tomorrow. I know in the daytime or at nighttime. Yeah, I think it's the one with the yellow things inside. That are the maple trees. Big leaves are maybe, yeah, I, I I can recognize them in the daytime, but the nighttime, like, it's hard to tell. But I think it's the one with the yellow, little yellow dots. Why did you let it fall into the water? I know that was an accident. I didn't mean to. All right, let's sleep. Oh, maybe we're not gonna have enough. Maybe we're gonna be short by a few hundred. Oh no, I have enough. I have enough. Oh, and it's raining. 
I'm gathering data on the correlation between soil alkalinity and crop fructose level. Long story short, I need a fresh melon from your farm. Sure. Well, I don't think I'm going to get... Oh, yeah, I do have some melon in my... I just need to make sure I don't give him the gold one. And the corn. Yeah, I need to give the corn to the community center. I'm going to keep that. I'm going to sell that. Oh, yeah, the ones with the yellow are the maple trees. So I'm going to... Okay, so that one is fine. And I put it on the other... I put it on an oak tree too by accident. Oh, where did I... Oh, there. All right, like this. And we're going to take care of our chickens. Oops. Did I pet them? I think I forgot, right? All right. Uh, so now, 350. Okay, I need to go get a little bit more wood. And I need to find where I'm going to put my barn, actually. Where will I put that barn? It's probably going to be temporary because I've not figured out, like, my whole farm layout yet, but... Mm, maybe somewhere where they can have grass. So, like, either... Oh, why not here? Yeah, this area would be not too bad, right? For now. I could put it here and then they could go in that field there or yeah I don't know or what about near the water here yeah okay let's just cut that grass here I'm gonna put the barn oh but maybe I should keep that space for farming like maybe I should put the buildings in the green on the green yeah, I'm going to put the, the barn on the green area, actually. To kind of maximize my space a little bit. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. I'm so bad. I keep doing that. I keep cutting them. I always forget they can go in the water and then you just lose everything. Unrelated, but Omega Crafter posted a new roadmap. They will add fishing, controller support, new coding blocks, biomes, and more. Ooh, nice. Looking forward to it. I'm wondering with the new biomes, I think we'll probably have to restart our save file, right? All right. I've got all the wood I need. I've got all the wood. Are you excited for Haunted Chocolatier? Yes, I'm looking forward to it. Um, oh yeah, I will play it when it comes out. I'm not like... I don't mind waiting a few years for it. But yeah, I, I'll be... I am looking forward to it. I still have so many games to play. I have so many things to play. So I, I really don't mind the wait. 
Waving hello to everyone. Hoping everyone is well. Safina, how are you? I hope you're doing good as well. I'm doing pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah. Construct. Farm. Building. Barn. Build. Yeah. Let's do it. Oh, it's pretty small. So. Yeah, I think here would make sense. So the animals can go out here or maybe... Yeah, I'll put it here for now. All right, so that's going to take a few days, right? Oh, Demetrius wants a melon, right? Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that before forgetting. It's about time they introduce the characters in it, though. Yeah, but also I think they should keep some surprise, right? Sometimes it's fun not to know, like, everything in advance about the game. And just... Oh my gosh, my fences are breaking. And get to discover it as things, you know... Get to discover it when the game comes out. Mm, I, I, I forgot the fences could break. Um. Well, well, oh yeah, one melon. Oh, I just have go. Well, anyway, I'm not gonna get the gold ones. I'm not gonna get the gold ones for this summer, so it doesn't matter at this point. I'll have to wait for next year. Gotta go for a bit. I got some work I need to get done today. Katie, thank you so much. Enjoy your work. Enjoy your work. Put iron fences, you'll rarely replace them unless lighting strikes. Yeah, I think I'll have to see how they look. Honestly, I don't mind replacing. I don't mind replacing some fences. All right, that is done. Now I gotta save some money for a cow. And then at the end, at the end of the month, I wanna upgrade my watering can. Yeah, so maybe we can repair. Since there's a storm today, I think I'm gonna wait for tomorrow before I repair my fences. Just gonna break, break those. Remove the broken ones. And we're gonna fix the holes tomorrow. I think this one is fine. Because it's newer, right? So, alright. So that's good. And now let's get some more wood. Oh, tomorrow I gotta watch TV. Tomorrow's the um, cooking, cooking show. I recommend upgrading your axe to iron axe to go through the secret wood as you'll need a lot of hardwoods as the game goes on. Yeah, I know. I wanna upgrade my pickaxe first though. I wanna upgrade my watering can, my pickaxe, and then maybe my axe after. Yeah, I usually, I like the watering can, but I usually always upgrade my axe first so that I, after that I can get more ores more easily and then I can upgrade all of my tools faster. Day 21 of summer. Right, let's check. Mackie roll. Oh, nice. And you need micro roll right for the community center. So that's good. The sprinkler is working here. We got our little little sprinkler. I'm gonna put 
that away. Uh, actually, yeah, I can sell. I can sell some stuff. Oh yeah, I need the corn for the community center. I love how you can move. One little detail I love in this game is how you can, like, you can charge your tool, then you can still move. Because there are some games where, like, you charge your tool, but you were not aiming in the proper place, and you have to, like, waste waste your water and energy. I like that you can still move. All right, we're going to fill up, fill up that watering can. Oh my gosh, look at that. Look at that. Yeah, we're gonna fix our fence today. The maple syrup always takes so long, I feel like. Uh, okay, we're gonna put that here. And okay, let me see if I can make some fences. All right. Uh, okay, let me water my crops. For oh, I forgot. Yeah, I went to wa uh, fill up my watering can and I forgot. So that is done. And now my barn should be in construction. Yes. Let's check our mushrooms. I know how often... The cave is so out of the way, I always forget about it. Oh, yeah. It's not like on the default farm where... Like, you can easily go there every day. I mean, you can still easily go there, but... You have to, like, think about it a little bit more. Gotta go do my daily task for my game. Good luck, gaming, Josh. Thank you so much. Enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. All right. Let's dehydrate those. And, oh, yeah. I need to go to the community center. I can cut this, right? Oh, yeah. I forgot to move the mushroom log to near mossy trees. Oh, should I? I thought it was better. I didn't know. I thought because we were talking about the mushroom logs and the beehives earlier. So I, I thought people were saying to put the beehives near the trees. So I guess the mushroom logs you should put near the trees. Let's put it here. There's one mossy tree here, one there, one here. All right, let's go to the community center for our corn. If you carefully cut the green grass around patches of blue grass, it might allow the blue grass to spread. Oh, I, I still don't know. I still not, I'm, I'm not sure. What's the difference? What does the blue grass do? I still have not figured out the difference. Leap a lot. Nice to see you. I hope you're doing good. Yeah, I'm still not sure what the bluegrass is for. 
Does it give you more? Hey. Um. All right. So now we will give the corn. Uh, is it? Wait. Oh, that's a quality corn that I need. Isn't there? Oh yeah. Regular corn here. That's done. I think it makes the animals grow faster and be friendlier. Oh, I see. Blue grass causes faster friendship gains. Oh, that's good to know. Good to know. So you shouldn't cut it then, right? Because when you cut it, it just turns into hay like the regular grass. So you should like leave it outside. Got it. Got it. Okay, I'm gonna go repair my fence. And then maybe we can try to do that. Cut the grass around the blue grass so the blue grass can spread a little bit more. Gotta take advantage of that Meadowlands farm. Everything's breaking. It's not too bad though, it's not too expensive. It's not too expensive to fix. Oops. All right, so that's done. Blue grass is better loved by the animals and doesn't disappear as fast. The green grass don't cut the blue. Yeah, I didn't know I was cutting it because I thought it was like maybe giving me more hay or something. So I'm gonna cut the green. Green grass. Like this. Oh, chicken statue. Oh, I can donate it to the museum. I think I have a few things to donate to the museum, by the way. There was a stick earlier. Oh, I probably gave it. Okay, let's go to the museum. Let's do that before I forget. I too randomly find chickens. <laughs> chickens in my grass in my yard. Yeah. I mean, it's nice to find some, find some stuff. Statues. I wish it was a real chicken. I wish I would find real chickens in the grass. I should buy more chickens, by the way. Maybe I should do that. Maybe I should do that. Like, usually in most farming games, I always wait until I have the incubator. But in this game, it kind of takes a long time. It takes a long time to get the deluxe. Like, before you can make your own chickens. Yeah, I think Piper's chickens are, are real chickens. They're not they're not just statues. Um Oh no, wrong building. I need to go to the museum. I yelled at my harvest moon rooster out the window because he was getting close to the road. He ran into the grass around one of our trees and started yelling back about it. <laughs> You're not my real mom. Your chicken sounds like a lot of fun. Um, rewards. Oh, we got a chicken statue for our chicken statue. That's nice. A statue for a statue. So we're going to place that maybe near our chicken coop. I adore them. They are so silly. Yeah, they sound like a lot of fun. A lot of work too, right? They sound like a lot of work. I mean, you gotta feed them, clean their stuff, pick up the eggs, make sure they don't get eaten by wild animals.
Alright, so that's gonna go... I think near my coop. Yeah. Just like this. And then I can sell my mayonnaise. Oops. And should we go make some friends? Yeah, let's go see. Uh, for the rest of the day, let's go chat with people. It's not all fun, though. We had to help one move along yesterday. She'd been sick about a week. Oh, no. She wasn't improving. Yeah, that's the thing, too. Like, sickness. Death. I'm struggling to make ends meet. I don't have enough patience. Harvey. Can I cheer you up with some... Summer squash. That's such a nice gift. Thank you. You're welcome. You are so welcome. Oh, we got a heart with Sam. Yeah, we're making a little bit of progress. Dun, 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 dun. Evelyn. Sweet peas are in bloom right now. You know what? I have one just for you. It looks wonderful. That's very kind of you. Yes, of course. They don't make sweaters like they used to. That's so true. Alex is working out. I wasn't very productive today, Marnie. I know how that feels. She's never at work, though. She's always out. Shane, what does Shane like? Someone said, I think I think quartz is for Sebastian, right? Maybe he would like quartz too. Oh, are you giving me your garbage? Oh no, he doesn't. No, he doesn't like quartz. Okay, let's go in here. Uh, for Haley, I've got. Would she like some acorn? Oh no. That is such a stupid gift. I'm so sorry. My name field my name means field of hay. Oh. Did you know that? But I like to imagine it's a meadow full of sunflowers. It's so dark. Oh yeah, it's already eight. All right, we're doing not too bad. That's a new dialogue. Oh, is it? Yeah, I, I can't really notice the new dialogue because it's... I haven't played enough to like... And I never talk to anyone. <laughs> so it's hard for me to notice the new dialogues. It's nice that they're still adding some new stuff though. Some new lines. Haley just told you one of her favorite gifts there. Yeah, I think I do have some sunflowers, actually. I think I do. Maybe we can keep one for her. If I didn't sell all of them. We have one. Let's keep one for her for tomorrow, and um, yeah, and then let's go to sleep. Let's do one last day before wrapping up the stream that I'm going to have to go eat my lunch. Oh, I want to get, no, I want to get a cow. I want to get a cow before the end of the stream. Maybe we'll have to do two more days. Hailey likes sunflowers and when you can get to the desert coconuts. Ooh. All right. Let's fill up our watering can.
I'm going to have such nightmares with Stardew while playing. How come? Why would you have nightmares? Once upon a long time ago, I had a tiny pewter acorn necklace and I loved it. I lost it for a long time, but I've always had an eye out for another one. Ooh. Was it like a real, like a real acorn? That's cute. Acorns are cute though. I mean, I don't know what I would do if I had like an acorn as a gift. I don't know what I would do with it. How do you like the 1.6 update so far? It's good. Honestly, it has been a while since I played Stardew Valley, like before the 1.6 update. So a lot of the things don't like I'm like a lot of the things I'm not sure if it's from 1.6 or like before. But I really like the new farm. And all the new little details that they added. Um yeah, so it, it's a good update so far. I like it. And it's mostly like a good excuse for me to like get back into Stardew Valley. Cause yeah, otherwise it had been a while until like I had I played it. And uh, I feel like I've been playing it more regularly since I started that new farm. So yeah, glad to just be playing more Stardew Valley. Oh, it was this a little decorative acorn for me. Acorns always mean meant potential. Ooh, that tiny thing could be a massive tree one day. That's so true, right? And that's a nice way. Nice way to see things. Speaking of acorns, I'm throwing my daughter a Totoro birthday party this month and acorns are a party favor. Oh, that sounds so fun. Totoro birthday party, that sounds so nice. I wish I had themed, themed birthdays like that. Like your daughter, so lucky. Oh my gosh, those planks? I just changed everything. Those fences, I mean, I just changed everything yesterday. What's what's wrong? What's wrong with that? All right. Let's take some mayonnaise. Let's go see Haley. Give her some sunflower. And then. And then, yeah. This goes there. I'm gonna have to, like, organize my chest a little bit better than that. Sling shut, I don't really use that. All right, let's go see Haley. By the way, I feel like there's not been a lot of festivals. Let's go, maybe go check the calendar. I feel like there's not been a lot of festivals in summer. Right? Did I miss something? Uh, oh, Trout Derby. We missed, we completely missed the Trout Derby. I feel like no one talked about it, right? We completely missed that. And Luau, that was before the stream. I think we started on the 13th. Books set on the 25th. There's just two festivals in summer. Dance of the Moonlight Jellies on the 28th. Is she in her room? I don't know. Specifically a pink Totoro party. So many things I've had to edit, print, and make customs to pull in the pink. Yeah, I can imagine. Oh my gosh. She's very lucky, but it's because it's the parties I would have adored to. That is nice. That's a nice, nice gesture. I'm sure she's going to remember that birthday for so long, right? When you do something special like that, it's, it's going to be worth all every effort you put into it 
Oh, she's at the ice cream stand. Oh, Alex should be there too, right? Oops, sorry. Elliot didn't mean to hit you with my sickle. With my scythe, I mean. Oh, no one at the ice cream. No one at the ice cream stand. Dun, 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 dun. Maybe. Oh, got some. Oops, I didn't mean... I always give stuff by accident in this game. Because there's so many things you can do both with, like, left click and right click. I know, I always, I always end up... I don't know how I do it. I always end up giving stuff by accident to everyone. Reminds me of Cornucopia accidentally hitting NPCs with tools. We gotta play some more Cornucopia. They've updated the game so much since last time. I need to get back to it. Where is Haley? Where is she hiding? Maybe she's shopping. Nope. Can hello, hello. Try the beach. Oh yeah, let's go check the beach. It's summer. We should go to the beach. Pick up some stuff. It's extremely rewarding. Thank you, Steven. I'd love it if she eventually got interrupted. Farming Sims. And I could throw... Oh, into Farming Sims me. And I could throw a team per day for a Star of Seasons or even Harvest Moon. That would be so fun. That would be so fun. Oh my gosh, I would have loved, like, when I was a kid, like a Harvest Moon, Harvest Moon 64 themed birthday. Oh my gosh. Let me see if I have new bobbers. Probably not, because I've not been fishing. But then again, I don't know. I don't even know how you unlock them. Oh yeah, I think this one is new. The duck is still the cutest, so I'm gonna stick to it. Do you like the new update? Yes, it is a good update. I am enjoying it. So the kids are here. But where is Haley? She's hiding from me. I hope you're having a great stream, Josh. Oh, Cray. Yes, I am. Yeah, thank you to Miss Fang for your gifted sub. Yeah, that's so true. Thank you so much. We got a little hype train at the beginning of the stream on Twitch. Yep, 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 yep. Um... All right, where is Haley? Can she be in the like near the mine? Maybe. Let's see. Let's go take a look. Is it normal that all of these thumps are? Are these always there? I just noticed like all of these tree stumps. Were they always like that? Worms beside the blue bleach beach blanket. Oh, did I miss a worm? Um Oh on the beach? Oh yeah, too late. Oh, they're always like that. Oh, okay. Never mind. I thought it was different for a minute. Oh, Woody Secret. I didn't know you could get books from... Fell trees have a 5% chance to yield double the wood. Oh my gosh, that is so good. I love those books. Nice. You can buy them from the bookseller too, but they're usually kind of expensive. 
And the bookseller is going to come in a few days. So maybe I should save some money for him too. My pet guinea pig, David, hates this hot weather. He's fussy. Oh no, poor David. Geeky Mina, thank you so much for following on Twitch. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> All right, let's keep going. Um, yeah, where's Haley? Where is she? Where is she? Let's go check the Adventurers Guild, by the way. I want to see if I can buy... Last time I bought a weapon, I found another weapon right away. So I'm kind of scared of buying weapons now. But let me see. Should I? Now I have... What's the damage on this? 4 to 8. I'm kind of tempted... To buy this. All right, let's go. I want to buy the swords if I were you. Oh no, <laughs> uh, it's fine. It's just money. It's gonna come back. You will get way better swords from the enemies. My little sword was kind of annoying me. But can you imagine if I got a... I, I better not like get the same sword from those crates. Okay, no. I guess it's a no since the chat... Okay, can I... I give you so many warnings, like all the time. You need to stop like complaining all the time. I'm sorry, that's like, I'm done with that. I'm sorry. All right. That sword though, I can feel the difference. It is, it is much, much, much better. I think buying a good sword is worth it at the beginning, but remember to keep your price, prismatic shard if you get one. Oh, what's a prismatic shard? I keep that in mind if I, if I ever get one. If I ever get one, I will keep that in mind. Why is the music so sad? I really struggled with the mines in the beginning. I love them now. Yeah, I, I love... The Honestly, the monsters are annoying. <laughs> I like the mining itself. And it's not that I'm dying or anything, but the monsters are just kind of tedious. It's a rainbow colored gem. Don't give it to Gunther. If you take it to a secret spot, it gives you something. Oh, I see. That's good to know because I would good to know because I would have probably given it to Gunther. Oh my gosh, I need to eat. Do I have... Oh! Oh, did I... Oh, did I click on the ladder? Oh, I just wanted to eat. Yeah, I didn't notice the ladder was there. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else I can eat. The music sounds like a place you return to after a long time that brings back nostalgic memories. Right? It is nice. And now, now the music is gone, but... It was a it was a really nice track. Yeah, that new sword makes makes things much easier here. 
I don't regret buying it. I don't know if I'll have enough. I don't know if I'll have enough money for the cow though. I forgot how much the cow costs. Oh my gosh, it's midnight. Let's go to bed. Ah, we're so close. We're at 48. Oh, dwarf scroll. What is that? Oh, it's an artifact. Do I have time to get that silver? Oh my gosh, there's a bat coming. Oh, I got some refined quartz. Look at the time. I know I'm hurrying, uh, hurrying back home. Is the stream going to keep going till the first cow? I'm, I'm, I want to get, I would love to have a cow by the end of the stream. So I think tomorrow the barn should be done, right? Or is it going to take one more day? I'd love to have a cow. Well, I'll see how much it costs to... I mean, my main goal today was to make friends. We got... I just had one heart with Rob. We got a few hearts. We did not do too bad. All right, let's sleep. Uh, let's sell our stuff first, actually. Just in case I'm a little bit short for the, you know... For the cow. I'm gonna sell those tomatoes. Sell the corn. I can sell some hop too. I know I want to make beer, but... It's gonna take a little while before I can get the kegs and everything. All right, let's sleep. What a productive day. Hi, just for Haley. Try the lake. She loves snapping pics there. Oh, good to know. Oh, mystery boxes. I still have not figured out. In my other save file, I've had the mystery boxes like fall down, but I could never find them. So I'm not sure how they work. Oh, Marnie isn't working until Wednesday. What day is it now? Oh, it's Tuesday. Okay, so we'll have to do one more day. Always keep a few of each item. You never know when you're going to need it for a request or recipe fest. Yeah, that's true. I know. Ideally, you should keep some stuff. Yay, we got a barn. We got barn. We can get a cow. So tomorrow we can buy a cow. You get them from chopping wood and stone, scything, regular activities. Oh, the boxes? I see. I thought you would like just see them, like literally just see them in the wild. Okay, that's good to know. Maybe we can try to get some boxes today. Chopping wood and stone, scything. Okay, let, let's clean up our farm maybe and try to find some. Event fishing and treasure chests. Try. Let's try to find some. Uh, sell our mushrooms. Uh, all right. So the bomb's gonna go there. Oops. Copper is gonna go in the other chest, like this 
and okay yeah i'm gonna bring the scroll to the museum okay for now let's farm make some blueberry jam and then sell everything else I can't wait to have the iron. I'm really overdue to upgrade my upgrade my watering can. Oh my gosh, why 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 are my fences breaking so quickly now all of a sudden? They lasted until like they lasted so long and now they keep breaking. Oh by the way. You don't even have to remove them. You just like put them over the old ones. How much longer are you on just not too long, maybe one or two more days. I want to have a cow. I want to get one cow. So yeah, apparently I think Marnie's not going to be working today. So yeah. Let's water that. And then I'm going to try to get some mystery boxes. I have no idea what's in them. I've never found one. So let's do that. Apparently you can get them by chopping trees. So I think I'm going to do that. Because I just spent all of my wood. I spent all of my wood for the barn. If you go right when Marnie passes by the cash register, sometimes you can catch her on her days off. Yeah, sometimes I did manage to catch her like like early in the morning but i think at this time it's probably too late right let's remove that green grass i know how rare those boxes are I wish they would implement like in Roots of Pasha Coral Island where you can make the time pass slower. Yeah. For me, I do like the... I think there's probably mods you can do for that, right? If you're playing on PC, mods you can download. I like the faster days, though. I like the faster days of Stardew Valley. Where you can't you can't do every single thing every day, you know, you gotta you gotta choose, prioritize what you're gonna do. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna pass out can I drink some mayonnaise? I get those mystery boxes all the time. I, I wanna get at least one. I wanna see what's inside. Oh my gosh, those fences. What's wrong with them all of a sudden? Oh, I think I forgot to pick up the eggs. Oh, yes, I did. Oops. Let me see if I have another another like maybe like a field snack or something while i'm waiting for my mayonnaise to be ready
this is not not great but it's gonna give me a little bit of energy i would have like a 10 to 20 percent slower time passage yeah and it's always nice when you have the option to change it to fit your fit your preferred playstyle. Uh, right, let's chop some more trees. Random question. I'm going to be traveling in a couple of weeks. I've never played my Switch in public as I'm an adult and I worry about the judgy looks. Do any of you play games in public? Yeah, Ashley, don't feel... Honestly, like... I always, whenever I travel, like on the plane, if I'm on the plane, I like to play. Don't worry about people judging you. Even if they judge you, there's not, there's not much you can do about it, right? Just enjoy, enjoy your life. And like, you know, I was a flight attendant and like when I was working in the planes, I, always, I often saw adults playing games and it's not like, I think it's more common than you think. Yeah, don't feel bad about it. Don't feel bad about it. There's no shame. Just ignore the looks that are just boring and don't enjoy fun. Right? These people are just miss. If they're judging you for playing games, they don't know what they're missing. They're just missing out. I play on public. The only annoying thing is that sometimes people will watch. <laughs> yeah, they will watch everything. Judge your judge your gameplay, right? Let's plant some trees because there's not like I'm deforesting. That's not good. I haven't played Harvestella on my Switch in public before. I have no shame for that. Yeah, there's no reason to be ashamed. Yeah, there's no shame in enjoying the life. Well said, well said. You're all making me feel better. You're the best. Yeah, honestly. Uh, let's go see Gunter. Oh, it's too late. What time does the museum close? It closes at four, right? Oh no, six. Let's go. Let's go to the museum. I go to hospital three times a week, and I take my laptop with me. I'm there in an open ward playing games on my laptop. Yeah, especially like if you go, you gotta go there three times a week. Like, you can't refrain from, like, doing something fun just because of others, right? You gotta, yeah, do what you want to do. Uh, I've got some new ideas to sleep on. That's good. Oh, Alex, long time no see. Oh, I didn't mean to give you that. Oh, my gosh, I'm so sorry. And then we've got Haley as well. If my hair wasn't so popular with the ladies, I swear I'd shave it all off in a second. Um, Haley, I've got a sunflower for you. They are beautiful. These are my absolute favorite. Amazing. You're all dirty. <laughs> she went from like a really nice, loving sentence, and then as soon as I have nothing to give her, she's like, "You're gross." Okay, let's go to the museum. Yay, new reward. Rude. That was really rude of her, Haley. Ooh. Big bear. I really need bigger house. I really need to expand my house because I have no, no space for all of these things that I'm getting. Oh, is the bookseller today? I think it's pretty soon, right? Not today. Not today, but pretty soon, I think. If you need any buildings on your farm upgrade, yeah, I do. Oh, there's a quest here. Robin would like to hire someone to fetch red mushroom. Oh yes, I do. How much? How many? Um, just one. I do have some, so let me go get them. Are you doing community? I'm doing the community center. 
And yes, Ashley, I do hope you're having a nice trip. I, I hope you're having fun. I hope you'll have fun no matter where you're going. I don't know where you're going, but... um. By the way, oh my gosh, I have so many things here. So many things. Mm, rice shoot, star fruit seed. Oh, I should have planted that earlier. Yeah. Well, now it's too late. Um, what else did I? Oh yeah, mushrooms. It's in my mushroom chest. Don't hate my wife, Haley. She's rude, but she has a heart of iridium. Yeah, I like her, actually. I don't dislike her. She's a little bit rude sometimes, but I still like her. Red mushroom for Robin. I think I saw... Wait. Yeah, I just saw Robin, right? She was walking around. Miggy, thank you so much for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. Let's go see... Uh, at that time, maybe she's gonna be at home. Mm. I don't know where Robin is at 8 p.m. Everyone like the stream? Yes, feel free to leave a like on the stream. If you're watching on YouTube, you can leave a like on the stream. If that's not already done, that helps support the stream, support the channel. If you're watching on Twitch, you can follow on Twitch. On YouTube, you can subscribe as well. All of these things. All of that, all of that. Each treatment session in the hospital is at least three hours. I'm not gonna sit there and twiddle my thumbs, you know, and just watching TV is boring. Exactly. That's like, if you go there three times a week, that's like nine hours a week. Might as well make sure you do something you enjoy, right? So I couldn't give the red mushroom. So I think tomorrow I should be able to uh, buy the cow from Marnie. Hopefully. I should have enough money for that, right? I'm gonna have like 5,000. I think that should be enough. So let's sleep. Let's sleep. You deserve all the likes, awesomeness, and support. Thank you. We got 100 likes. I can't see the number of likes now. It's hard to... Like, the way I'm streaming now... Because I have Twitch and... YouTube. Oh, lightning rod. Wild seeds. Oh, nice. Let me see if I can make some lightning rods. The way I'm streaming now with Twitch and YouTube, my YouTube window is like too narrow and I, I can't see the number of likes anymore. I would need to like a lot of work to see it. Um, Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Oh, I love that music. And our melons is almost ready. Our corn is ready. Oh, did I forget to water? Like, the corn is not growing all at the same pace. I should have fertilized that melon before planting it. Because I need to get the gold. The gold thingy. Gold star. Ooh, I'm gonna bring that corn to the community center. Mayonnaise. Hey, Josh, super late as usual. Kim, nice to see you. I think it's gonna be our last day today, so you are <laughs> you are there a little bit. It's okay, we still have one. We're gonna get a cow. We're gonna be here to name our cow. Help us name the cow. To upgrade really need to upgrade my watering can
All right, and then melon. I'm getting hungry just watching those melons. Okay, that's good. The scarecrow is kind of in the way, right? I wish you could walk over this scarecrow. Are there better scarecrows later on? I think they are, right? Oops. Scarecrows like cover like a bigger area, so I could like, put them a little bit more out of the way. And so we watered that, and then um, we are gonna go buy the cow, and then go to the community center. Oh, let's go check our mushrooms. Oh, the deluxe scarecrow is 12 tiles in each direction. Oh, that's good. Yeah, I'm glad there's a better one. And then we gotta go see Robin. So Robin, community, cow, Robin, community center. It's gonna be a productive, productive day. Hopefully I have enough money. I mean, the barn was 6,500, so I can't imagine the, a cow being more expensive than the barn. Purchase animals. Oh, 1,500. Oh, yeah. What about... Oh, for the sheep, you need a big barn. I see, I see, I see. I would have loved to get a sheep and a cow. How should we name her? I don't like these random names too much. You know what, Kim? I think I'm gonna name this one for you. I'm gonna name this one for you, and then we'll we'll I'll, I'm gonna buy another one too. Okay, purchase animals. How should we name the second one? Sneerta. What's that? What kind of name is that? I so badly want to come back to Stardew Valley, but I'm playing three games now. I'm forcing myself to finish at least one of the games before I start a new Stardew Valley. Fine. I know there's so much. Like recently, like uh, I've been playing Omega Crafter. I've been playing that. And there's Pathless Woods that just came out too. And I've been wanting to play that because um, I enjoyed the demo. It was a bit overwhelming, but it was still fun. And yeah, I want to play. There's just so many things I want to play. I do not like that. Please do not. Oh my gosh, Kim, I'm so sorry. Oops. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean. I'm so sorry. Well. Uh, how should we name our other cow? I was going to say Abigail after the cow and the fox and the hound, but yeah, there's a character, there's a villager called Abigail. We can rename them. Maybe we can rename her. Yeah. Sometimes it's challenging to play games in public. People are curious, which I haven't started asking all kinds of questions about what I'm playing. I ended up talking. Instead of playing my game. Yeah, if you can talk about the game, though, that's nice. Maybe you can make some new friends. Poopery. Moopery. Uh, maybe Poopery could be better for a chicken. Because in Friends of Middle Town, she was working in the poultry farm. Muna. Muna is kind of cute. Okay, let's do that. Mona Lisa. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, and we're going to rename the other one. Because uh, I think... I think Kim didn't want to be a cow. So we'll... Oh, she's so cute, Mona Lisa. Uh, I think we'll, we'll, we'll find another name for the other one. I'm sorry, Kim. All right, this one. Kim. Okay, how should we? How should we? How should we name her? You have to click on the car, but you can rename. Yeah, it's nice that you can rename them at like any time. You can also sell them, right? Oh yeah, four four seventy two. Um, 
Mabel. Mabel is cute. Let's do that. Thank you, thank you. We got Mabel and Mona Lisa. That's a good team. Maribel. Oh, Maribel is cute too. Maybe, maybe for the next one. We've got lots of names starting with M now, though. All right, that is good. So we gotta see Robin, and we gotta do the committee. Let's go start. Let's start with Robin. Yeah, we made some good progress though. We got two cows. We got a barn. Got some... Worked on our relationships a little bit. Does he like mayonnaise? He looks like someone who would like mayonnaise. Oh yeah, this is a very interesting specimen. Nice. Oh yeah, he wants melon, right? Wait, did I give... Oh no, I think... Because I didn't read... Yeah, I, I already gave the request. Uh, M Blue, thank you so much for following on Twitch. Uh, Robin. Mushroom for you. Thank you, thank you. I want to see to expand my house. 10,000 V and 450 pieces. I think I'm gonna do that next because I'm I'm starting to have like a lot of furniture, but I have no space uh, to where to put my stuff. And I still have like, yeah, my money is doing not too bad right now. Oh, I need to keep some money for autumn seeds though. Sometimes, sometimes I forget about that and I start a new season and I have no money to buy seeds. Um, oh yeah, the corn. Corn, corn, corn. Yeah, I gotta keep money, money aside for the seeds. All right. Oh, you know what you can do? I didn't realize you, you don't need all four. So even if I don't have the melon, actually I'm fine. I'm going to be able to get the pumpkin in fall. I didn't realize. I thought you needed all four quality crops. So I'm going to do that. And then. Oh, but I still. I'm still missing like the beans and the potatoes from spring. Yeah. Um, anyway, I'm missing a lot of stuff here too. Lots of fruits. Gonna get milk soon, and then cheese. Maybe I can make a cheese maker in preparation. I need hardwood. Oh, I don't have a hardwood yet. I don't have enough hard. I have eight, I think. Most people don't finish the community center year one. Don't worry about. Yeah, I'm not hoping to finish it in year one, but I still want to kind of like. Don't want, like I still want to <laughs> kind of finish it, right? Uh, Jade, I think I do, Elliot. I think I do have some Jade for you. Sometimes I can buy the missing crop from that mysterious card vendor. Yeah, I think so. Is that on Sunday? Oh, Friday and Sunday. Yeah, I'll check if she has potatoes and green beans. Yeah, I'm glad I kept some, like, random items, because I think I do have... Yeah, Jade for Elliot. I don't know where you find Elliot, actually. I see him randomly sometimes, but... Maybe at the beach? Let's go check the beach. In his beach house. Yeah, I can't go inside the beach house, but maybe like he's gonna be outside. I'm on my third playthrough. This is the first time I actually did finish it year one. It was very stressful. Yeah, I can't imagine like trying to finish it year one. Especially like the fruits. 
and all this stuff like all the fish oh what is she is oh is she painting drawing In order to finish the community center in year one, you basically have to plan for it and work towards it from the start. Yeah. It's kind of like if you want to have like um, like the perfect photo album in Harvest Moon 64. You really have to like prepare for it, you know? And yeah, you just have to prepare for it. And like you can just play like I'm just kind of like playing very casually. Going with the flow, which you can't really do if you're trying to do the community center in one year. I'm on my third playthrough. This is the first... Oh, sorry. I read that already. Uh, Elliot, where are you? Oh, go to the forest by Leah's house. Okay, wait. While I'm here... Uh, no, I have nothing to give to the museum. I was going to say I'm going to go to the museum, but there's nothing. Nothing to give. Let's check by Leah's house. Lea, Lea. I don't know how you, you say it, but anyway. Hello, Mayor Alex. I'm so sorry for the gift the other day. I'm going to give you something nicer this time. I actually had an easier time finishing your one with remixed bundles than the standard ones. Oh, is that a mod? Does it give you more difficult bundles? Oh, yeah, there he is. It must be satisfying to follow your crop from seed to harvest. It is very satisfying. Nice. I'm doing good with the request. So you don't get the ticket every time, right? I think I just got one ticket. Oh, it's a mode you select. Oh, it's a mode you select. Oh, it's not a game. It's a mode. You select at the start of the game. Oh, I see. Do you think you'll get 100 plus hours in Stardew now with the new update? I think I will. Right now, let me check. I'm at... I'm at 80 hours now. I'm at 80 hours on Stardew Valley. So I will get to 100 eventually. Oh, we got a little raid on Twitch. A slacker raid. We've come with a couch. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Unfortunately, you're catching us at the end, but maybe we can do another. Maybe we could do a raid of our own on both Twitch and YouTube and see. Um, see who should we raid. There's probably, I feel like at this time of the day, I feel like often I stream at night and there's no one. Like when I finish my evening streams, but hopefully there's going to be someone fun to raid today. Got a fair amount of lurkers who enjoy watching my game dev stuff. Ooh, a game dev stream. That sounds fun. I've never watched a game dev. Well, I, yeah, I've never watched a game dev stream, but that sounds like a lot of fun. What kind of game? What kind of game are you working on? Oh, I should have kept the trees around the mushroom log, right? I always read it as Lea, like the famous Filipino singer Lea Salonga. Oh, yeah. I usually say Lea, but sometimes because it's like Lea, Lea. Sometimes because it's like, hey, I don't know, I'm tempted to say Lea. But yeah, usually I say Lea. Oh, you're making a farming sim. Oh, that's fun. What's the day? I, I should look it up. I'll look it up. You won't find it? Oh, I won't find it. Oh. Well, I'll keep an eye for hoping. hoping. Hopefully in the future we can see it. Soup5, thank you for following on Twitch. I'm already... I'm already hungry, so hungry right now, and you guys are coming with your food, your food names.
a game dev where you say on Twitch, yeah, I'm, I'm streaming on both Twitch and YouTube. So if I'm responding to like someone and you're not seeing the messages, it's probably on the on the other side. All right, let's sleep. Let's sleep and try to do a little raid. All right. Well, that was a productive, pretty productive stream, right? We did a lot of love stuff. We got some new cows, made some friends. I will spend the next two years making the demo, maybe three, and then crowdfunding, and then I'll go from there. That's good. You're going to be, like, prepared. Like, some people do the crowdfunding, like, the first thing, and then it's a big mess. So it's it's good if you have, like, a demo and, like, everything, everything ready, you know? Um, all right. I'm just curious. I want to see the bookseller. I'm doing it that way to avoid that problem. Yeah, that's good. Uh, have you played Planet Crafter? It got officially released yesterday in a house co-op. I've heard so many people talking about it. I want to look it up. Um, I think that could definitely be my kind of game, but I've not played it yet. I have not played it yet. Um, all right, so let's just see the bookseller, what he has. Um, mining monthly, gain some mining experience. I want to get, like this one makes your horse faster. This one makes you walk faster. 15,000. Yeah, I'm going to keep my money for that. All right, so I'm going to quit. Exit to desktop. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. If you want to watch something else, we're going to do a little raid. Uh, you played Stardew Valley for 80 hours and are only in summer year one. Is the game slower than a traditional farming sim? Um, this is not my first save file, so that's why. That is why... Okay, uh, let me check on... Okay, let me start. If we're going to do a raid, we're going to start with YouTube. If there's someone that I know... Oh, I, I don't know anyone. I don't know anyone who's streaming on YouTube right now. Okay, so for YouTube, that's going to be it. If you're watching on Twitch, we're going to try to do a raid. But yeah, so thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. So that's the YouTube stream.